know that if you go to jewelrymaker.com and sign up to our mailing list, then you'll receive 10% off your first order with us. We'll also keep you updated with special offers, theme shows, program guides, and jewelry maker tutorials. Jewelry Maker. Create, wear, share. It's the hottest time of the year. We're in the midst of a heat wave. The sun is shining. Everyone is lapping up the sunshine. So what are we going to do? Christmas in July? Yes, you've heard us. We're going to get you jewellery makers ready for the festive period with plenty of time to spare. We have a launch of carrier beads with Mark Smith, brand new Christmas charms, brand new Umbra jewellery boxes and displays, DVD launches. We've got a beautiful sterling silver angel wing pendant, sparkling micro faceted rubies, the most amazing strand of Ethiopian opal plain rounds and so much more. You need to be watching. It's going to be a cracker. Get it? Cracker? Christmas cracker? Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Jewelry Maker are very excited to be bringing you the launch of Umbra Jewelry Displays and Storage Boxes. Tune in on Wednesday the 25th of July at 10am where we will be joined by Umbra's brand rep Emma Russell. We have some exciting products to bring you such as the Toto Storage Box, Jewelry Stands, Ring Holders and some beautiful jewelry boxes. So make sure you're watching this Wednesday at 10am on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker have an extensive range of DVDs for all abilities. Each of our mediums has an introductory DVD to help you get started. If you're already an experienced Jewelry Maker, we have a collection of projects and more advanced DVDs to take your designs to the next level. So visit our website for more information. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Did you know that when you book a Jewelry Maker workshop, you're given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. Hello my lovelies, welcome to Jewellery Maker. You might be thinking, what on earth is going on? Christmas in July. Hello, Hello. Nadia. Mwah. 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 Right, I've got a brand new treat for you here. And they are mm. Mm. fancy, mm. fancy, fancy. Mm. Love them. Kaya Night Cabochons. <laughs> I told you it wasn't my day today, didn't I? I did say it, didn't I? I'm having one of them days. Oh, God. Just... Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Lucy. Oh, somebody help me, please. Oh, oh. oh dear. Oh, yeah, these are... We... Ah, we haven't got one of those little grabbers, have we? Because they're very... No, no, okay, we'll see if we can get one. Okay, let's try it again. Let's try it again. Right, then. 
We have 15 carats of kyanite cabochons in these ovals. Now, in my example, I had four. How many did you have, sweetie? Also four. Oh, you also mm. had four as yeah. well? You tend to get a big one. In the two samples I had, you yeah. tend to get a big one and uh, then um, uh, three smaller ones. Okay, and that's exactly what I've got here yeah, as well. Uh -huh. So we've got these large ones. There you go, that's better. So Nadia had the same thing as me. She had one large one and she had three smaller ones as well. So if I just show you each one of them for a blue, 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 blue Christmas. Did we find out who sang it? I wonder. Wasn't it? Was it Elvis or Shaking yeah. Stevens? I'm sure it's one or the other. It's a bit before my time. I a blue Christmas without you. It's got to be Elvis, hasn't it? Sounds He's got the same birthday, isn't he? Yeah. Well, I've got the same birthday as him, to be fair. <laughs> I think everybody's going to compare ourselves to Elvis. Yeah, same birthday. Uh, he was a bit partial to Tiger's Eye, wasn't he, Elvis? Was he? Yeah, the big oh. Tiger's Eye room. Oh, yeah. Elvis Presley, there you go. Thank you. So then, uh, a blue, blue, blue Christmas with this brand new kyanite. Now, I'm going to let you into a secret. Currently, we've priced these on our jewelrymaker.com website at 19.95. So if we could throw in 60 metres of the silver-plated copper wire to go with it, that'd be great, wouldn't it? 50 metres of 0.4 on the bottom and 10 metres of 0.8. So if we could throw in, if we could do all of that, so give you the kyanite for 19.95 as it is on the website, and then add the wire in, then we'd be laughing, wouldn't we? Oh, absolutely. Because it's a free wire. Mm. Yep. Yeah. So then, brand new kyanite cabochons. We've never had them on air before. We know how difficult, hopefully by now, all of us that have been learning about uh, gemstones, just how difficult kyanite is to cut. Right. And you loved this kit, didn't you? Mm, I did, yeah. No, I was quite spoilt with the kyanite, so... Could you say to my producer, because it's the first time he's met Nadia. Um, Nadia? Uh, Wayne, Pasca, she's like, what, I'm just here. <laughs> oh, dear, sorry. <laughs> I did warn you before we came on. I'm all over the place today. <laughs> Pasco, when I said she's ace, do you see what I mean? It's just because I get given all these awesome things to work with. That's how I'm just There's that. a bit of that. <laughs> and then there's a the bit that you get to be like the master chef of jewellery maker and turn the ingredients yeah. into that. But when you think about it, Nadia would have, would have, if she'd bought this kit, she would have effectively paid for the kyanite, mm. got all of that wire for now. All right? Um, stunning jewellery. Right, are you ready for this then? You ready? 1995, we should, we should be able to, ch we should charge you for just the kyanite alone. However, code is OZXC23 for brand new kyanite cabochons. So we've, we've discounted the kyanite and we've given you... So that, that there is discounted by a pound. And then we're going to say, well, I'll tell you what, have 50 metres of 0.4 on us. And while we're at it, we've got a sneaky feeling you're going to want to wrap that round another wire. So how about we give you 10 metres of 0.8 mil as well? Now that is your stocking bonus. Mm. So, you know, like, like when you wake up, and hopefully, if you've been good, you clearly haven't. She's decided she hasn't. I do still hope you get... You've got time to rectify it. Do I? Yeah. I suppose I've still you've got, got a few months You've got time to rectify time. it before Father Christmas. Can I wake it up? Yeah. Can I She can. She can. She can. I have every faith in you. So, you get your little stocking at the end of the bed. Yeah, with all your little gifts, don't you? Well, there, we've just get, added that to your stocking, and it hasn't cost, it hasn't cost you a thing. The whole of that 60 metres is free. Now then, uh, oh, Suzette, she is straight in. Thank you for your support on The Late Show. You're always there amongst many of our regular gang. And Denise in California, Linda in Yorkshire, Helen in Somerset, Janetta in, in Cheshire, Anila, hello, all our Late Show crew are here. Mona in Georgia, Elaine in Wiltshire, Nicole in Florida, Jill in Sussex, you can hear this is going right over the, over the pond to our... American cousins, isn't it? I know. We're international. We are, aren't we? We're worldwide. <laughs> it's 
It's good, isn't it? Anyway, so, but to be fair, 18 95 for those kyanites, those brand new kyanites, 115 carats, sorry, of kyanite in those, and they're all ovals that you get, okay? All oval in shape. So when you show us what you're going to do, you're going to show us how to set one. No, I was going to show you how to make that bracelet. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, yeah. The, oh, that yeah. is lovely. Because it's a technique that I really enjoy using and okay. it involves hammering and twisting wire. So I thought I would show you oh, how to ace. do that. Yeah. Brilliant. Yeah, great. So $18.95. We've discounted the coin. We've thrown the wire in. It's fantastic. Um, really well done. Now, the, the kit, unfortunately, because it's kyanite, there's not going to be very many, are there? Because as we know, kyanite is a rare, is a rare gemstone. So we never get very, a, a big parcel of kyanite. It's very limited year on year. It's, it's, it's always the same, so it's always very limited, unfortunately. So when you see a, a little note to self, whenever you see kyanite, whether it be a strand or rarely in cabochons, and you fancy it, you've got to check out pretty sharpish to avoid disappointment. Just a little insider heads up there for you. And especially at that price point. I'll tell you what they are. They're going to all over. They're going to Arizona, Florida... They're going to California, Georgia. They really are going all over, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And in fact, our lovely Alison in the beautiful city of Bristol has just said, I'll tell you what, at that price, thank you very much, Jewelry Maker and that free wire, I'll have them too lots. Well, that means, Alison, you've just got yourself 120 metres of free wire. That'll last you. I mean, the 50 metres of 0.4 lasts you a long time for weaving, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've still got left, so. Yeah. <laughs> it's good, isn't it? Uh, right then, now then. Right then, now then. While you jingle your bells and check those out, should we have a um? Should we have a demonstration with you, beautiful Absolutely. girl? Absolutely, please. Yeah. Your jewellery is superb, sweetheart, as always. Oh, thank you. Thank I you. I enjoyed enjoyed the skit. So you can tell. Fun to work. You yeah, can really tell how much you enjoyed it. Yeah, that was fabulous. Um, wow. All right, so I was going to show you how to make this bracelet just because I needed to do a bit of hammering okay. on the day. So, <laughs> oh, you're going to, yeah, I think I might need to move over so that, you, so okay. that we can see you because it's all about right. you now, darling. Oh, is it? oh. It's all about you. There we go. Is that better for you, Mike? Oh. Can we see now? Yep. Good stuff. Okay. So I'm going to demonstrate, I'm just going to bring this over. Yeah. Right, yeah. So I'm going to show you how to make oh. this bracelet um, with the sort of flattened wire centre. Uh, that looks amazing. And it, it's actually really easy to make. It's a lot of fun. It's good practice if you haven't done wire work before. It's a good practice to to get going with different weaving techniques. So okay. um, yeah, I really enjoyed that. Right, so obviously the, the centre piece is made up of woven of uh, twisted wire. Yeah. And the way I've done this, I've taken the point eight that we get here. Um, and I've taken a good length because the, the longer the wire for twisting, the better. Okay. Um, uh, it, and it depends again, I've used four strands. For four strands, if you use it, you get um, a more closed look. So that's a very uh, dense look. Yeah, If you okay. use just two strands, you get something that looks like that. So oh, it oh just, it's very different, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, very different. So it just depends on the, how the many wires you want, you want to use. Yeah. So, I've used four, okay. uh, and to twist, I'm just going to show you how to do that. So you pick up strands, make them quite long, maybe about 50 centimetres or so. And there are several ways you can twist them. I'm just going to do it with two. So if you have family members, you can have one holding one end while you twist manually, okay, okay like that. Uh, obviously, it gets a bit harder, so you need to have someone to help you. Or the other way, uh, which is the way I've done it at home, is uh, if you have a drill, you can stick the two ends into that, uh, I don't know what... That's Drill section. chuck. Into the chuck. You don't need any special bits or anything like that. You put it in, mm, you so hold you twist one twist the nozzle end. and it slots in, doesn't it? It does, yeah. yeah. And just make sure when, you, when you're pulling it, and the same applies if you're doing it manually, um, you're twisting it, make sure you pull it uh, tight because the, uh, the more even your, your twist is, the more um, even your... Mm. Um, the pattern. If you have a look at this ring here, that was sort of my first attempt. I'm just going to bring it across. But if you think about it as well, we've got those wire twisting tools. We've got to do two different types. Could you use those? Absolutely. Right. You could so work. If you've got the wire twisting that, tools, either that of them. That would work perfect. Yeah. So this this particular ring was was uh, twisted, and the, the twists weren't perfect. So it tends to give you a more rustic look. Yeah, I okay. like that though. 
Uh, but if right. you want it to come out a bit more perfect, let's say not as perfect, but uh, oh, no, you, know what, you know what I mean. Uh, you need to make sure that your twist is as even as possible. A more consistent okay. yeah, twist. So once yeah. you've twisted it, you'd end up with something like this. Okay. Uh, and this is the wire. So I'm going to now make a little bit of noise. So you need a chasing hammer and one of these blocks. Okay. okay. And what you would do is very gently just start hammering. And you have to keep your hands, your fingers on it to keep it straight work your way down. Keep it straight and just make sure that you keep your keep your finger. And again it depends how flat you want it. You keep yeah. going or you you just stop at a certain point. Um, and you just keep Sorry, I'm making a lot of noise. It's here. all right. And you just have to keep your finger on it because if you don't, it tends to buckle and twist. Right. Okay, so just try and keep it straight and yeah. straighten as you work. Um, and work your way up and down. Also, while you're hammering, it, it hardens the wire a little bit. Okay. So that's great uh, for it to give it a bit more structure. going to keep obviously until you have the desired effect as I said if you're using four strands it gives you that effect if you use three or two it gives you a more open weave okay mm -hmm. so depending what you want so now this is our centerpiece obviously you need to measure before you you cut it how long you need it for your bracelet to be okay so uh, this is quite a long piece and that's actually long enough to go into a bracelet okay great um, and then the next step is to actually weave it into uh, the bracelet itself. And okay. for that, we need two sections, one at the top and one at the bottom. So I'm going to show you here how it looks. Okay, so we've got four wires at the top and then four wires at the bottom and then the, uh, the sort of hammered bit is sandwiched in between. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to sh show you how to add in the wires. So I'm going okay. to pick up, again, cut, it depends on the length of bracelet you need. So I've probably used about, um, what is this, about 20 centimeters, just to make sure that would be too long, but okay. obviously you don't want to go too short. So you'd yeah. rather go too long than, than too short. And uh, we're going to pick up all of these wires and start with four. So I'm looking for my point eight. So I'm gonna just take a section off here again. I, I tend to work off the reel when I, when I work with wire. Mm. And just because it helps me not to waste the wire, yeah. um, and also the, the weight of the reel keeps the wire in check for me. So what we're going to do now is pick up one wire, and we're going to take our point four and wrap it around once. Leave a little tail at the end to have something to hold on to. Pick up the next, and go in between the first and the second, and loop it around once. Go around once, push it up, add in the next one. And I tend to bend out the wires at the end a little bit so that I. It's can easier see where to I'm add in them. for you, isn't yeah. it? So at this stage, it always tends to be a little bit more fiddly because obviously there's no structure to anything. Um, so once you've done a few weaves, it becomes much easier and then there's a lot more strength to it because the, the weaving wire will give yeah. it structure so you've added in four again you can add in it doesn't need to be four it can be two or it can be ten if you want to it just makes the, the cuff wider um, and then the next step is to actually bring in I'm just going to trim this make it a bit shorter sorry I'm going to put this down because it's going to ping all over the place so I'm just I'm, I'm keeping hold of it just putting my safety goggles on I'm keeping hold of it because it's quite tough oh there we go we're done yeah, nearly. Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's fine. Get back on. Right, so we're going to bring this in and we're just going to use this just like we did before with um, the other wires. Go around it once and then just keep adding in the other top four wires at the top. So I'm going to slide them in underneath it and always hold them at one end. There is a tool, like we have a ring mandle um, on the website which 
sometimes I tend to use when I have too many wires to work with because it's a lot to hold, especially yep. if, you, if you're new to wire weaving. It can hurt, you know, the muscle in your thumb if you have yeah. to put so much pressure. So um, I use a ring mandrel sometimes to just clamp it shut. And then uh, I have, you know, free. Also, it helps you with with putting the wires down. You work down without losing where you were. So keep bringing this in. So that's yep. uh, the last wire here. So when you're at the top, we're just going to go back down. So we're going to do exactly the same. And we are just going to loop around each wire okay on the way down just precisely as we did on the way up okay so in between each next wire then go around the center and keep going yeah now this is just a center part to keep all the wires together yeah so you keep going and I've gone up and down probably about two, three, four times, just to give it a little bit of structure. Where am I? Sometimes, sometimes I think I need glasses. I can't actually see anymore. Well, I'll tell you what, <laughs> I don't, you, you might not be watching on Saturday, but we had the, the new Carson magnifying lamp. That, oh, it is oh, brilliant. It is fabulous. Honestly, I think that'd be great because it was on a big windy neck that you could just move. Oh, really? And it was magnified and then it got a little light and an extra magnifier within it. Oh, it was perfect for you for that kind of work. Oh, that's great. I've actually, Freestanding, I've, I've it's got really a, good. I've got a lamp like that at home, but it's too bulky, so something smallish like that yeah. would be perfect. Oh, it was great. Anyway, I sorry. need to have a look. Yeah, I'll have to show you that. Anyway, okay, so once you've done, I always tend to come in with my, my chain nose pliers to press the weave yeah. together, just to make it much neater. Okay? Yeah. So then what I've done is basically gone up and down a couple of more times, um, and then it would look like this, and you can already see... There's Start a lot more structure yeah. to the section here. Okay, so now once you have reached the section here, it's time to actually do the detail work. Um, and the way I've done it is um, I zigzag my way up and down. Okay, so I'm starting with three loops at the bottom. So that's one, two, and three, like so. Yeah. Then I work my way up. So I go one up and loop it once. Go around again and then work my way down to the bottom again. So that's one. And then again count one, two, and three. And then we're going to do exactly the same again. So we're going to go one up, loop it around once, move one up again, loop it around once. And I tend to bend the wires out at the end push it and then I move my way back down again. So basically we are doing exactly the same pattern as we did in the beginning. Yeah. It's just that we're zigzagging and I'm building up to a long uh, length. So yeah. then we're going to do again three loops at the bottom. This is just to make the solid. Okay. One more time. And then the last one is one. Two, mm -hmm. and always push with my finger and also quite often while I'm weaving I will take my pair of pliers um, so bring it around once and I will push my weaves together mm -hmm. just simply because it makes them look neater yeah okay so now the next step is we made one half of the longer section here, okay? So now what we need to do is obviously make sure that the center gets uh, captured too. So we're going around it once. Yeah. And loop it around it. Twice. Yep. And then again, work your way back down. until you get to the bottom and then what you do next is work your way back down until you get to the smallest now what you need to do next is obviously at the top there is no wire available okay oh yeah so you need to trim off so you can't really work off the reel you'd need to trim off a okay. piece if you only got one if you've got two reels great you can work off two reels but to start the top section here you'd need to trim off a bit of wire 
and start exactly the same process from the top. So you'd come in here. Hang on. Again, this I can't see. So again, you'd start one, two, and three. And just make sure that whatever weave you do at the top matches what you have at the bottom. And when you get to the section, I'm just going to switch this over, okay? When you get to the section where you are adding your wire at the bottom, you will then not add your wire at the top because you add the wire every alternate. Yes, does that make sense? That does make yeah. sense. And you just carry on doing this until you get this sort of pattern here. How long did, does, did the bracelet take you from start to finish, roughly? Uh, oh, I can't remember, to be honest. probably about two hours. Behave! That took you two hours? Yeah, it, it, I mean, once you get going, maybe it'll take me about hours. two years. <laughs> <laughs> two well, weeks at least, if not two months. I have to say, the beginning is a little bit more fiddly because well, you've yeah, got longer wires. because you're balancing wires. the wires and you've yeah. longer wires and you just... But it's worth the patience, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's cool. I love this sort of weave. Of course you can. So, and then the last section is obviously there are multiple ways to finish the spray. So the way I've just done it uh, was just quick. Trim the, the wires at the end. It's quite a lot of wires actually to trim, isn't it? That's not trimming. I think I should maybe do one at a time. There we go. <laughs> one at a time. Oops. Sorry, Leah. I'm not doing it on purpose. I'm going for you. <laughs> and, um, Are you pinging? I'm pinging, yeah. You're pinging. I'm very naughty. And then you can do each section naughty at a time and basically just loop it over. And then if you wanted to, you could just make a clasp for that. Yeah, this one turned can. out a little bit short, uh, unfortunately. Nobody, nobody would have known that, but, but, but I had to be honest. <laughs> so uh, you could add a clasp, but that's it. That's, that's basically how you're that making it. That is gorgeous. So, Lovely you. looking bracelet, hon. Yeah, I, I don't make now. I like the sort of style. So that is just lo love that. I think the section in the middle really makes it. That hammered twisted section. Mm, it's all really fun lovely to make as well. So, yeah. Yeah. Well, do you know what? That's the lovely thing about making jewelry. It is fun, isn't it? Yeah. As I always say I have the best job in the world. Yeah. I always say that. So. I, 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 I think we do think that about our yeah. respective jobs, don't we? We think it's the. I, I always say that. Always say that. Now then, I'm a bit worried. I'm just a bit worried though. Thank you, sweetheart. Great right. demo. Well, because I've got a, I've got loads and loads of you checked out, great. But then I've got loads and loads of you with it still in your baskets. Now that's kyanite currently on our website, nineteen ninety five. So we've discounted the kyanite by a pound and given you sixty meters of wire free. All right. So I would just mention to Nicole, to Jill, to Carleen, to Anne, to Bev, to Jay, to Victoria, to Deirdre, to Hazel, to Julie. I mean, I know there's a lot of regular buyers there, and I know you don't need to be told. You hear it all the time, but we've all made that mistake, and we've gone, yeah, I know. And then we forget. And then we, then we think we've got it, and then we actually check our baskets and thought, aha, mm. didn't check out. I think as you get an email sometimes, like, oh, yeah, I forgot, yeah, and you look back, oh, and it's gone. Oh, yeah, and you're like, <laughs> <"That's laughs> uh, Honestly, that, that many times, I, I, I take my list that the producers write down, and usually I'm pretty good. I go home, and I sit down, I do straight away. Mm. But then I've got into a programme recently that my brother got me into, which does end in a week's time, and I'll be glad when it does, because A, I might be able to get to watch something else, and B, I won't forget to place my order, because I did the other night, and I missed something I really wanted for a friend's birthday, and I missed it, and I was really annoyed with myself. Because, of course, it comes tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock, either the stock's gone, mm. or it reverts back, and you want to pay mm. the price that you saw on the telly, don't you? The discounted one. Yeah. Oh. Um, oh, can we... Is it star bike time? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay we'll then. Be yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, we're going to do some lovely, um, lovely bells, which are really, really oh, pretty. Yeah. Very Christmassy as we're doing Christmas in July, and we'll do that for you as your very next little, little tingly star bike.
Which, which, which Christmas songs do we think when we think of bells? I'm not going to tell you by singing, so... Which, give me the name then. Jingle Bells. Jingle Bells, yeah, that's a good one. A good one. I was thinking, ding dong, merrily on high, da 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 da. I also think Scrooge the Musical. Because there's a bit in Scrooge the Musical when he wakes up and they're all playing the handbells. Jumping okay. up and down, playing the handbells. Mm. Right then, so, now these, I believe, are brand spanking new, aren't they? Producer. And look at the detail there. Proper bell charms, aren't they? And again, we're thinking wine glass charms, aren't we, as mm. well? As lovely little earrings. I'm so excited about these because they're, they're silver plated. Silver plated bell charms, brand new. And you get five? And I wouldn't mind, but they're 90. Is that right? Seriously? 99p each? Silver plated? Oh, brilliant! Oh. Wow, go on then, if you can do that, if you can, if you can give all of those for 99p each, oh, at 4 95 that'd be brilliant. Brand, oh, wow. So, you know, like, I don't know about you, but Christmas time is the only time I get cloth napkins out. Oh, right. They're yeah. in my, my, they're in my area, they sit there all year. You set the table. Yeah, yeah. and, what else, and the, the ones that you roll up like a scroll. And then you, you in fact, we had a, an, an entry to the Wall of Fame at the weekend with napkin rings. Oh, yeah? right. Yeah, yeah. And then you have those as the, as the, as the, and then, oh, then they could be the gift for the, for the, for your friends to take home. Oh, that's a fantastic idea. Yeah, when or, the, yeah. That is great. And have it as like a wine charm, make it, or make your own crackers. I was just thinking Save the same Save your toilet thing. rolls, make your yeah. own crackers. Oh, yeah, now we're, now we're cooking on gas, aren't we? Yeah, make your own cracker charms. That's much better than, uh, yeah. those fake fingers you get or something like that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, or the fly in the eyes, you're like, really? <laughs> yeah, make your own, write your own Christmas joke, and it could be, it could be relevant to that person. Could write a Christmas, oh, yeah. That's lovely. Yeah, that's nice, and then, and then put these in, I think these are just lovely. They've, no, they've, we've never had these before, they're absolutely brand new, you've got that little sprig of holly at the top, look. Yeah? And then you've got that lovely detail of the bells. The bells. So, pendants, earrings, charms, mm. inside crackers, napkin rings, wine glass charms. You could do key rings. Yep. Bookmarks. Mm. Handbag charms even for Hand Christmas. Charms, yeah. Yeah. You could even decorate your Christmas in that, your, your Christmas tree. So again, you know when you make it like a Christmas garland or a wreath for your fireplace or your front door? Can you actually imagine having silver plated charms on there? Or... Dare I suggest this? I don't know whether it's a good idea. You could tell me, because I know we're all cat and dog lovers. Add that to the dog or cat's pet collar for Christmas. Oh, that's a nice touch. Do you like that? Yeah. <laughs> so your cat or your dog or whatever's got a little collar, and then they could be spruced up for Christmas. Do you like that idea? I quite like that. Mm, I think it's lovely. Do you know, I've fallen in love with, in love with the dog over the road. There's a, there's a new carver poo that lives across from me called Henry, and I'm, I'm literally in love with him. He walks past like the poor woman, Mary. I've lived there five years. I've never spoken to her. I've spoken to her more in the last month than I've spoken to her in five years. I've never spoken to her. Now I know her name. Literally, she I could see her. You can almost see her looking at my house thinking, am I going to get past? <laughs> and she gets to about there, and I've clocked her from the bay window, and I'm out. Uh -huh. And I go, Henry! And he goes, over uh, the road and there he is, and I bet she thinks, oh, oh well, great, I just wanted a quick walk. <laughs> Hi, Mary! <laughs> but, hello. <laughs> I'm running today. <laughs> I'm in a rush. Oh, Henry. <laughs> <laughs> It's like Hello. they've got an excuse to go into the office at the moment to see uh, oh, Marie's Marie's dog. dog. Oh, Marie's dog. Here, I went in for a cuddle today. Cuddle. Marie, oh. our general, she brings her dog to work. Beautiful. Is she Labrador? Black Labrador? I think so. Not sure, yeah. yeah she's a really gorgeous. lovely dog, isn't she? So all sorts of excuses today yeah. to go and say yeah. hello to yeah. the TV. Yeah, lovely. Now, those are going... Hello, darling and Paul. Hello, everybody. So people having two each. £4.95 silver-plated brass bell charms. Lovely. They're so cute. Oh, is it the is it the posh one? It's the posh holly one. Zee holly and zee ivy. Have we 
Oh. Oh. Those Have are Have you fancy. got amber? Anyway, and when I draw on Christmas cards and, and things, this is always what I draw. I draw three holly leaves and a berry. So this is pretty much what I draw. Aww. But it's, look at this. We've gone, we've gone from, we've gone to colour. Full colour. Looks like resin, doesn't it? Mmm, it does. It's gorgeous. Mm. I was just thinking, wasn't I? The holly and the ivy. I quite like it when you offset the silver with a bit of colour like that. I like that, you know. Mm. Yeah, it's really pretty, isn't it? The holly leaf charm. I mean, we are rocking and rolling. It doesn't matter how many wine glasses you buy for somebody. We've got everything today. Snowflakes, stars, gingerbread canes, reindeers. You can have them all at once. On Angels. The time, can you? Yeah, holly, bells. I told you there's a lot today. Now then, the only, the only slight worry, my loves, this has been very, very popular here for us at Jewelry Make, and we only have left, ooh, when I say it's unlucky oh. for some, 13. That's not a lot. And they've nearly gone. So sterling silver, beautiful, gorgeous, green holly leaves. I love the fact that there's three, because we like uneven numbers, don't we, in jewelry making? I've just applied that to my planting and my borders at home. Have you? Yes, I've decided to plant in threes okay. and uneven numbers. I love to do working on even numbers specifically because when you do a neck piece, just the uneven centre piece just yeah, absolutely. Know, hangs nicely. Um, right then, so um, would you like to see it on the on the um, on the skin and my décolletage? Do you know what décolletage <laughs> means, Wayne? Your neck in it, great in it. Right? Your neck in it. <laughs> well, it does, darling, but do you know what it actually translates into from the French word? Your sideboard. Does it actually? Yes. Okay. Didn't know that. Does this look like the face that lies? No, no. <laughs> She's like, well, actually, yes, it does. <laughs> yes, your décolletage, which sounds beautiful in French, translates pretty much into your sideboard. Okay. <laughs> As, oh, okay. <laughs> That's attractive then. Would you like to sit on my sideboard? <laughs> um, not really. Looks great on your sideboard. Thank you, darling. Same. Thank you. Yeah, six ninety-five. Brilliant. Ninety-five sterling silver. First person to check out has had de. Do you know what I got most excited about buying at the supermarket today? Ice cube bags. Do you know why? Now, I'm going to say this, I go to a posh supermarket and I had to go to a non-posh supermarket today because at the posh supermarket, they've changed their ice cube bags and I'm not happy. Before, you'd fill the ice cube bag, ice cube bag up and you'd watch it and it'd be great because you'd go filter all the water down and all your water, and you can see your ice form. And normally, you just, once you finish, you turn it upside down and it self-seals, mm -hmm. chuck it in your freezer, great. These were changed. Why can't, if things work, why can't, why do people mess with them, right? Because now, now, fill it up, you have to tie. But when you tie the knot, it all pours out again. So they're going back. So I had to go to a slightly perceived to be less posh supermarket today, and they had brilliant ice cube bags. Good stuff. I was like, yes. You show them. Yes. I don't want to. I think ice cube trays. I always have to struggle to get them out. Get those silicone ones. They're great. Are they? Yeah, they're fab. Should I get them instead then? Mm. Where do I get them? Hmm? Where do I get them from? All over. Okay. Can, we, can, we, can you show me Because I like ice in your water. Gin. <laughs> in, in your water, yeah, yeah, me too. Yeah. Which one, darling, sorry? Oh, can we do the knot in 13 as well? I love that. I love it. I think that looks... Now that we had an amber weekend, I know, because I was on it yesterday and Saturday, and it was brilliant. I got the amber chalk. Did you? I'm excited. <laughs> Oh, oh now so. these! Oh my word! I don't know how we've got these today. We're quite, we're quite uh, treated specially today. Very three D, aren't they? Look, very pretty. They've been very popular. Um, I'm told I've not seen them. That is gorgeous. There's only two left. If I'd have known I'd got in the show in the show today, I'd have had one of those. Oh, they're beautiful. Baltic amber. Oh my goodness me! That is a wonderful price, hon. Wow, two chances only. 
to... And Neil, have you just got those, sweetheart? Uh. Baltic Amber Multicolours. That is lovely. Sweetheart, that is beautiful. I've never seen that mm. before. We've, yeah, very different, aren't they? Wow. Well done, Anila. Well done. Well done. Oh, my word. Oh, no, they're stunning. The way they interlock. Very clever. Oh, do I actually get to see it? I saw it on TV the other day and I get to see it for real. Yes, meal. well, we had a little mini showcase. I know, I saw um, yes. day before yesterday, yes. wasn't it? No, it was Alison was on it, I remember. It was yesterday. It was yesterday. It's a long time since yesterday. My memory doesn't last that long, so. It was yesterday. Okay. I was just thinking, was it? <gasps> oh, my word is a stunning. Oh, <laughs> Don't drop it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh wow! I have, I have an incredible Moldavite gemstone in a in a gem in a gem collector's box. Rare, natural, brilliant cut, quarter of a carat. So you've got an easy solitaire there. I will show you as a ring, just to give you an idea of size on that quarter carat. See, ample for a solitaire ring, isn't it? This, I was saying, now this is a fantastic statistic. When this, the impact of this meteorite from outer space on our planet, it was travelling, when it did, 14.7, 14.8 million years ago, at 13 mm. miles per second. That's just crazy. Which equates to miles per hour. So you know when we drive at 30, 40 miles per hour, you know, 70 miles per hour, if you're lucky, is the maximum, isn't it, in the UK? For 70 miles an hour on a dual carriageway or, or motorway, if it's safe to do so. 45,000 miles per hour. That is crazy. I... I don't think that's the correct price point, but it's on the screen, so you can help yourselves. There's one left. And it comes in the gemstone collection box as well. A rare, natural, collectible, Moldavite, brilliant cut gemstone. Meteorite piece, isn't it? Yeah. Crazy. I mean, you know, gone, obviously. I don't... Th on. How did you get to that? For Moldavite. Whoever got that. Well, we have a deal of the day here at Jewelry Maker. And on the late show, we have a steal of the day. That was it. Yeah. <laughs> that was well done. You can have a little look at that. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Can, oh, can we? Do you mind? It's, yeah, it's this because I think this is, and I've got this, and it just looks lovely as a pendant or earrings. It's, it's one of those sort of um, lovely designs. A lot of the high-end designers do a knot design. And when you think about it, I think for those, for those people that make macrame, and we've got Nadia here, who's the macrame, you should be called the madam. <laughs> <laughs> in a good way, you know, like the madam, <laughs> okay. like the ultimate, the ultimate macrame madame. Oh. I think a madame, do you madame. think? A madame. Oh, yeah. Now, you're known for your knots, because you tie knots in macrame. Wouldn't that be a nice gift for a macrame person? Mm, definitely. It? It's very symbolic, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's lovely. Yeah? Now, this is two precious metals. I've only got eight chances left. Gold-plated, sterling silver... Lovely symbolic, not mm. pendant designed. Even for chain mail, looking at it now. Yeah, because it, it, it isn't a Mobius ring, mm. but it gives that effect a little mm. bit, doesn't it? If that's you know anybody that's about to get married, tie the knot. Oh, right. That's great. Oh, Anila, she just messaged in. Oh, Papa's, what did she say? I waited for this strand the whole weekend. Finally. Oh, well done. 
I'm going to be truthful with you. You know that strand? I'm going to show Anita one more time. Honestly, Anita, hand on my heart, my darling. Mm. I think of the strands that we do, you know, like the ones we do with the sterling silver spacers, the really posh ones, and then we did have the overlapping leaf design. That's my favourite strand of amber that I've ever... I didn't even know this existed, and I'll tell you what, Anita, that is beautiful. I'm so glad. I'm sorry you had to wait all weekend and you felt you'd missed out, but what a lovely little cheeky Brucey mm. bonus the day that you got them. Well done. She and the last two as well. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, Anita is one of our lovely regulars, and it's so nice that we've made, managed to keep you happy. So that made, that's made our day as a team. Well done. Now then, how many of these left, sorry? Seven. But yeah, tie the knot, macrame. Yeah. Anybody that's. It's like my friend just asked me to go to his sailing club and start sailing with him. So again, that's all about tying knots when you're in the boat. Yeah, that's right. Very yeah. nautical look. Very as well. nautical that's look. Mm. Yeah. I uh, just got on. Oh, did you? I just got mould of my oval. I wanted one so much, but I kept missing out. Look, I was on oh, my side today. Okay. Thank you, oh. JM. Yeah, a lot of happy people today. Oh, happy people. That's yeah. good. Oh, isn't it lovely? Because it's a lovely feeling. We've all been there on Joy Maker, haven't we? Where you think you've missed something, and then it comes up. You're like, oh, oh, and then you get you like. It's like all your Christmases have come at once, isn't it? Uh, right then, now this is obviously about to sell out at that price point. Hertrude, well done. Again, that to me is pop it in your birthday box, your mm. Christmas box. It's like today. Here's an example. Now, I bought a bottle of whiskey for Scott, our lovely sales manager that left recently, and it was £32. I hope he's not watching. But it's a posh one. And it was Penderian whiskey. There are other whiskeys, but uh, it's his favourite. And it was called Legend. It was a different type, and it's called Legend. And he's been a legend over the years I've worked with him. Aww. So anyway, I went in today, and it's my dad's favourite whiskey, Penderin, as well. He loves a Welsh whiskey, this one. And anyway, it was down to £25, I thought. And instead of thinking, oh, it could have been that one I bought it for the sales manager last week. But instead of thinking that, I thought, no. Get it? Keep that in the wardrobe for Christmas for me, Dad. Oh, £7 mm. I saved today to spend on something mm. else. It's a lot of money to save, yeah. isn't it? £7. And that, to me, is a lovely, lovely gift for somebody for Christmas or birthday. You could even make... I mean, it does look beautiful with that bail as earrings. I've got... Uh, mm. uh, sorry, as a pendant, I've got to say. It does look lovely. Are they gone? Three left. Three chances left at 8 95 Did I show you on the neckline? On, on, on my sideboard? On your sideboard, yeah. <laughs> Isn't that lovely? It's just... It's so... That's classical, that is, isn't it? Yeah. Classical. Mm. Mm. I think I would probably want to buy three because it'd make earrings and necklace. Go the whole suite. Mm. That's the lovely thing. No, we don't restrict you, do we? We don't get can only have one. Maybe you like while the stock's available. Right then, uh, what should you do next? What are they? Oh! oh. Oh, they really are. Oh. oh, and they've got a stamp on the back. Look at that. Oh, oh they are. No, I'll do, I'll do what you want me to do, but can I do that? They're so cute. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh man. I love dainty little things. I like know I do. Oh. oh, they're so lovely. Do you know what? They would be absolutely perfect oh. with a just a very fine jump ring in between each and make a very dainty bracelet out of them all. Oh, just rosary link in between. Oh. oh, come on. On the cutometer. And like Nadia said, they're actually 925 stamped as well. Oh. Heart connectors. I tell you what, they're lovely. 4.5 mil, aren't they? A lovely way to just gently extend an earring. Oh, yeah, 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 that would look fab. So can you imagine just doing it, just do birthstone earrings mm. for somebody for Christmas. Oh, wow, yeah. yeah Add those onto our gold-plated mm. 95 stunning silver shepherd hooks and then have the birthstone of their choice. That's lovely. That'd be nice, mm. wouldn't it? Do you know there's ten of those? I've not, don't, I don't think I've seen those before. There they are, the cutest thing. They're like Henry the Carver Poo. Oh. They're so cute. A carver poo. Carver poo. What's a carver poo? It's a, a King Charles Spaniel. A cava, no, a cavalier. Um, spaniel and a, and a poodle, and it's called a carver poodle. Aww. They're so cute. I'm going to have to snap a shot of Henry Arntine showing yeah. you. We're, we're going to have to see now. Yeah. They like that. Uh, Lorraine says, hi, got my mould of I always missed it. Woo, woo. Thank you, JM. Hi, well, that's everybody happy with the... Uh, well done, Lorraine. Good 
I'll tell you what, Lorraine, at that price point as well. Mm, I know. I bet you feel like you've stolen it, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> I bet you're like, you haven't, because it's, you know, we put we set the price, but I'm... <laughs> now then, how many of these little cuties have we got? Oh, do you know what the good news is? I've got, I've got, at the minute, enough to go around. So that's good news. So if you've got it in your basket and you check out now, you can have it. I just oh, think, I think they're, they're lovely. They're fabulous. Yeah, I really like them. So. Yeah, you got, you get ten of them, by the way. I've just noticed her t-shirt. I haven't oh, seen it. Leah's got a t-shirt on that's got on the t-shirt pocket. Ho ho ho! And Father Christmas's legs coming down the chimney. <laughs> <laughs> That's great! Oh, that's brilliant. I didn't, I've only just seen I've only, I've only been sat looking at her for nearly two hours. <laughs> and this afternoon, four hours I've been with you today. Have I not noticed that? It's not a sad thing. I've noticed you now. I was so taken with your beautiful face, I didn't spot the t shirt. Do you think that got me off? Do you think that got me off? Do you think that got me off? Yes. Yeah, do you think that? Leah doesn't doesn't hold grudges. She'll be fine. Well, she just had a nice bun, so oh. she can't be too upset with me. <laughs> yeah, lovely stamped nine two five sterling silver gold plated oh. lovely hearts. I think yeah, rosary link bracelet, mm. rosary link necklace, drop earrings mm. in between, adding four and a half mil with a gemstone, just lovely. Now, sorry, uh, producer, shall I do what you'd like me to? He said, make a change. <laughs> Well, if you would, Zena, that'd be lovely. <laughs> you don't mind doing what I ask you to do. In fact, don't be helpful. <laughs> you, oh, somebody's nicked it. That's perf. <sighs> no, don't worry. I got it. Okay. Ooh, that's oh, that's ice blue, isn't it? Ice, ice blue. And the lovely thing about Salon Sapphire is that it comes in a different array of colours, a little bit like your tanzanite. So you know when you you know when you go A grade, double A, double A plus, triple A, triple quad A, and all those. This is the iced blue that we thought was perfect for Christmas in July. I love that. I have the last six available. They are Sri Lankan because that is uh, what Salon was formerly known. Uh, Sri Lanka was formerly known as Salon, and Salon Sapphire is without question one of the most renowned locations for sapphire. Now, just remind me: Do I take it? Can I have the information through to the studio on this because I want to check something about that iced Christmas winter blue Salon Sapphire. Oh, it's just beautiful. Can't really decide whether it's purple or blue or, no. or grey. It just changes colour as you move it. Stunning. Absolutely beautiful. I think this could do with that as well. Okay. I'd like to confirm they are 100% natural. That's crazy. Yeah. Now, I would definitely recommend wholeheartedly, passionately, with every ounce of my entire being, that you quantify that by buying yourself the authenticity certificate because it's only 25p and it's worth every penny. Because if you can get proof that you own Salon Sapphire, mm. then you need to get it. It's, it's, it, it, be, it would, not criminal, but it would be <laughs> completely <laughs> wrong not to be able to prove to people that you've got the real deal of Salon Sapphire because that doesn't happen very often. That is a really rare treat. I mean, Christmas is once a year, isn't it? But my goodness me, that Salon Sapphire is as, is as rare as it comes. And the fact that that iced, that iced blue, that, and it is a Christmas blue, isn't it? Mm. A wintry blue. Definitely is. Yeah. Really stunning. Reminds me of a frozen river. Yeah. Doesn't it? Absolutely. A glacier. Ten and a half carrots. There are five Salon Sapphire. I would like to massively congratulate the lovely Carolyn Leicestershire, you've got them, sweetheart. Jacqueline, you may have missed them when we had these of a deal of the day recently. I'm down to, four, is it four chances now? 
Yep, Lily. Oh, I was at a party with a lovely girl called Lily yesterday. Lily in the tiny and weird, beautiful girl. These are the last ones that we've got. We don't have any more in the vault. That's it, I'm afraid. Ten and a half. Superb, high-end salon sapphire. Again, that is the perfect gemstone to make sure you've got in your stash if you are making mm. wedding commissions because that is the most delicate blue to give you that traditional something old, something new, something borrowed, but something beautifully blue, very high-end. Oh, my goodness, oh, me, aren't they? Can you imagine them with pearls and a tiara? Exactly. Oh. Or even a, a, a beautiful bouquet hair slide, hair comb, yeah, you know, but as you say, tiara, but... Can I just show you on the neckline just to give you an idea of how spectacular they are? Now, when I launched these on a deal of the day a number of weeks ago, um, all but six sold out. And now we have three or four left. Three left, I apologise. Just three chances left to own the most exquisite and the rare 5% of sapphires that are actually natural, as in no... No embellishment, no treatment, mm. no nothing. Just an exquisite facet work. And they have taken a facet really well, haven't they? And the fact that you've got salon stuff. We give you the gift box as well. So the lovely uh, metallic lid gift box uh, comes with that deal as well. Stunning salon sapphire for $59.95. Okay, two left. Two chances left. I'm... In, okay. Pearls. You've oh, got to have pearls at yeah. Christmas, haven't you? Because it represents the snow, doesn't it? For me, it just reminds me of the garlands my mum used to drape over the tree. I don't know if you remember oh, actually, back actually, yeah, the beaded garlands. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. So for me, they're a must. I'm very impressed with you, Nod, if your mum used to uh, drape pearls over her tree. Yeah, that would have been awesome. Do you know what? The prices we do and the metre length strands we do, I yeah. bet you there are some jewellery makers who are going to drape their tree in real pearls. Oh, can have you, you already? There's a text in. Do text in. I bet you there's one of our jewellery makers that have done that with the metre length strands we've had. Can yeah. imagine that? Oh, that would look so... Yeah. Oh. Or are you thinking about doing it? Genuine white freshwater cultured pearls. They're so satiny, aren't they? Yeah. Now, when we took a strand like this, and it was a 1995 jewelry maker strand of pearls to the local exhibition centre a um, year or two ago, we, we added a clasp and we put it into a jewelry box. And we took it to the show, to the wedding exhibition. And um, we asked everybody there, well, not everybody, but we asked as many people as we could, what sort of price you think this pearl necklace would be? The cheapest that anybody guessed was £125. The average yep. was about £200. Somebody actually said £2,000. Wow, yeah. Well, that's it. I mean, if you look at any drawer's window, and that's the sort yeah. of price you get. You Absolutely. Know, for pearls, that's yeah. why. But the quality of our pearls, it's not mm. just the price point, it's the quality of our pearls. XGRO96, 8 by 7 mil, full length strand of pearls, big size. And the whole strand of pearls for 19.95. If I've got time to give you a quick count, I will. Give you an idea of how many pearls you get. You, earrings is a good way to maximise the strand mm, for return and is, pendants yeah. and rings, but make it go as far as you can. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 50, 59 pearls. I'd say 60, so that's 30 pairs of earrings. Yeah, yeah easy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. 19, 95. And they're gorgeous, a gorgeous sheen as well to them. I love them. These are completely natural pearls. I know they're really bright white, really bright pearly white, but they're not bleached. They're completely as the mollusk intended. A lovely bright white, like the, like the fur on your Santa hat. Bright uh -huh. white, but natural. Just lovely. Uh, right then, that um, sterling silver snake charm bracelet with a Pandora style clasp um, is about to be yours if you would like to get the lowest ever price on that deal as your today's must have coming up after the break. Also we've managed to get first time since the birthday week I believe 
the halo um, gemstones that go on to the bracelet. And again, lowest ever price. So good luck. See you after the break. You can now book Jewelry Maker workshops online. Just head over to our Jewelry Maker website and click on the workshop link. We have a wide range of workshops from beginner to intermediate, covering a variety of mediums. Once you've found a workshop you would like to attend, simply click on the Book Now button. Fill in the required fields and then press Continue. This will take you through to the payment page. If you have any questions, you can contact our workshop coordinator at any time by emailing workshop at jewelrymaker.com. We look forward to seeing you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $3.95, or if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $5.95. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account, and the runner-up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com, or you can post your photos to Jewelry Maker Studio, Ivy House, Henley Road, Studley, B80, 7DU, and make sure you don't forget your customer number. Get making and good luck. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Getting started with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. When you spend $4.95 with us, you'll get a free welcome pack, which contains everything you need to get started, including step-by-step -step project cards and a DVD, which will give you the chance to be able to create an arrangement of different items of jewelry. You'll also get a manual, which will help to familiarize you with all the items you're going to be creating and all the tools you're going to need to do so. Plus, you'll also get a free pack of tools. These will be everything you need to get started. Getting started with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier, so why not give it a go today? Did you know that when you book a Jewelry Maker workshop, you're given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. Did you know that if you go to jewelrymaker.com and sign up to our mailing list, then you'll receive 10% off your first order with us. We'll also keep you updated with special offers, themed shows, program guides and Jewelry Maker tutorials. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share.
my lovelies. In case you're thinking what on earth is going on, Christmas in July. Although I did say to the MD today, Andrew, I said, where's the Christmas tree? Where's the Christmas tree? Are you putting it out in a bit? You've got to make it. Yeah. Have you? Yeah. Oh. We're on the ball today, aren't we? We've only been live for 12 hours. <laughs> Christmas in July. <laughs> We're promoting it for how long? And there's no Christmas tree. Come on. Should we all build, should we all build a Christmas tree later? Shall we? Yeah. Well, have you got to go back to Edinburgh? Oh, great, you can help build a Christmas tree then. There you go. <laughs> She's like, oh, that should quite like a rest. <laughs> no. Um, right then, so we've negotiated you a bit of a treat today because we think you're worth it. Like the shampoo. Oh, yeah, because I'm with it. Um, I, do you remember Dav David Ginola that used to do the advert? Do you remember him? I, I met him when we were out on holiday at a girl's uh, Hindu. Very nice man. Now then, today we are going to offer you two treats. It's a back-to-back, double-header, whammy, today's must-have, because this is your lovely Pandora-style clip bracelet with the barrel-style clasp, darlings, with the snake chain. So there it's slinky. It's lovely, isn't it? And I will be offering you a selection of the halo beads afterwards because we thought angel, halo, Christmas, lovely, gifts, great. Now then, I disturbed, a bit awkward, went upstairs, knocked on the door, managing director, come in, walked in, HR, somebody else. I thought, oh, awkward. I said, look, sorry to interrupt, <laughs> but we're having Christmas in July. I've got the snake bracelet. I, I've got, I want the halo beads. We haven't got the halo beads in the show. We've put them in. I said, can we do this? Can we do the lowest price ever? Yeah, yeah, great. Yeah. Zena, we're in a meeting. It's fine. Just yes or no. Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah, yes. Great. Then he came down for a meeting by the refuse bins. I thought, oh, here we go. Anyway, he forgot about that. So we've got it. So we're going to offer you. I'll show you how it opens up. It's a lovely, lovely clasp. It's some um, sterling silver. Now, obviously, if you've got that much silver in a bracelet, there is going to be a big grand weight of silver. And there is nine. 0.9 grams of sterling silver in there. It's a lot, isn't it? Now, if you've got any of our lovely amber charms with the silver in the middle, you could slide those on. They go great. Um, you might have Pandora-style charms. Um, other charm companies are available, of course, but you could put those on. We've actually come up with our own genuine gemstone charms. Genuine. Or genuine. So, yeah. So uh, we've got those coming up. Now, they're not part of the first deal. The first deal that we're bringing you is just the bracelet. Okay, so I'll turn them around because I don't want to confuse anybody. But the sterling silver snake chain bracelet, which is so fashionable, so stylish. And like Nadia said earlier, my lovely guest designer, Naughty Elf today, how lovely that if you buy somebody a charm bracelet as the base, sort of the, 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 the main part of their present, whether it's birthday, Christmas, anniversary, whatever, you can then stylize that. To, you, you can personalize it for that person with charms that are either that are personal to them or their family or their partner or their kids or whatever it might be. They're gemstones there, you know. And you could add any of the Christmas charms that we've had today, couldn't you? Yeah? Um, so I'm thinking as well, like that beautiful snowflake we had earlier for, again, lowest ever price. You could add that on, couldn't you? Oh, yeah, that's lovely. Yeah? Now, how, how high-end does that look? That's gorgeous. Doesn't it? Love that. Yeah? Now, what you do with these bracelets, just to mention, that is lowest ever price. I'll tell you now, if you check out, THIL32, I can guarantee you lowest price ever. 9.9 .9 grams of sterling silver, as our today's must have. Okay, the usual price is twenty nine ninety five. In fact, it's always been twenty nine ninety five, but we're going to give you a fiver off. Wow, that is great, I isn't mean, it? Just thinking what a solid sterling silver weight like that would actually cost. Nine point nine grams. That is just mahusive. In a bracelet, that's the most silver we do in a bracelet here at Jewelry Maker. That's it, that's the ultimate, you can't beat that. 
Okay, now what we've got here is... Oh, <laughs> see me check it down <laughs> She's in a jacket down then. Are you doing a roof? Oh, oh don't, oh, don't, honestly, that is still the funniest thing I've ever seen. I'm sure. Okay. Now, what happens here is, can you see, if I turn that around, there's like a, there's like a ridge. Can you see in the middle? There you go, there you go, there's your ridge. You just put your little fingernail or thumb into there, prise it apart. It's like a barrel. Okay. And then that section stays in there. That sort of set, set in there, and then that you just balance in into the there's a little little teeth mark on the edge. Can you see? Yeah. I and then love you just those clasps. Yeah. They're great for anybody with dexterity issues. I think yeah. they're so Ex easy to open. Exactly. Look at that. Mm. Isn't that clever. And that's it. Now we've got. I tell you what, as well. I've all, we've also negotiated for you the best ever, lowest ever price on the halo beads as well, the genuine gemstones. Now I'm going to tell you something. For the first time ever. Each of those beads is going to go to a fiver each, four ninety nine each. Yes, it is. So that saving we've just given you on the snake bracelet, that fiver, will get you one of those halo beads for free. Wow. Yeah. No, ninety five sterling silver. I think this. Now we'll do the halo beads for you in a moment. But I think this with the class. I'll just put that back on the uh, bracelet thing for you because I don't. Wanna, I want to hide those halo beads because I don't want to confuse anybody into thinking you get those that you have, those are separate. But that really stylish, wonderful 925 sterling silver snake chain bracelet with the barrel clip, and it's seven and a half inch at the maximum. First ever time. I've got to put that back up because I'm proper slid down, haven't I? <laughs> I look like a little elf. He's gone right. I got whoop. <laughs> um, yeah. What do you think about that then? That's the best ever, lowest ever price on the night show for you today. We've never done that before. It's always been 29.95. Not, not today though, $24.95, just for you. $24.95. Nine point, that's nearly 10 grams of silver. I think it makes a fabulous um, man's bracelet, I have to say. I mean, it's great for, for ladies to wear as well, but I think it's a fabulous gift for your better half for Christmas. Yeah. Well done. Yes to you, Lucy, is your question, darling. I think Lucy, our floor managers, are about to go shopping, aren't you, and treat yourself. I need payday. I need payday. <laughs> payday? Is, it, is our payday soon? Next week. Next week. Next week. Oh, no, it's... No, it's... Don't say that. It's next week, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, please, I hope it's soon. I've had to pay my car insurance and my house insurance. I hope it's soon. <laughs> Baked beans for the rest of the month. <laughs> right, then, 95 cents. What do you think then? So Amanda, June, Catherine, Valerie, Collector bought two. Valerie and Cyril. And uh, Julian, Cyril's a great name. And Carol and Anila. Oh, Anila, that's the... Anila, don't forget, when the... When it comes to 8 o'clock in the morning, that's going to jump back up. So, oh, hello, Nigel in Pembroke. We've got a lot of people in from Pembroke. Oh, Anila's got it. Anila, I'll tell you what. Anila, you lucky girl, you've got that fab amber strand, which I think is the nicest strand we've got of, of ever. And I've, I've just been on for 10 hours over the amber weekend, and I still think that's the best strand of everything we've got. So, well done, you. And now you've got that for the best price ever as well. So, I'm just going to check. How many do we have? Oh, well, that's, that's not enough, is it? Oh. How many left? Oh, okay, everybody, there's a little bit of a, there's a little bit of a, there's a little bit of a warning flag, a Christmas warning flag being risen. I have less than 30 left. So, Bryony, Collector, Laurie, Morag, Lorraine, Collector, I've got less than 30. Now, if you want to know how to buy, there are three ways. Would you like to name me one, Leah, on cameras, please? Um, tap the app. Tap the app. Tap the app. Nadia, my little elf, what's another way to buy from Jewelry Maker? Sorry? <laughs> 
was just prepping something. Zero eight hundred six four 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 six five five. Thank you. Is that free phone or does it cost you? It's free. Everything is free. Yeah, baby. Oh, and tap the app. Now, you know, when you just go to your app store if you've not got it. Download Jewelry Maker. It's like this morning when Mark was on with Eleanor and he was um, launching his new carrier bead. I messaged in, bought it over the phone, and then I messaged it on the app. And you can do it anonymously or put your name in, and, and then your name comes up. And even though I'm working, when he read my, me, Elle read my message out, I went, because I thought my name's on the telly. <laughs> I got all excited and I work here. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so you've got the app, Jewelry Maker app, and it's free. The app's free. Free phones, the phone's free. Free phone, phone's free. Or jewelrymaker.com, check out yourself. If you don't want to talk to anybody or you want to do it discreetly. 24.95, Candy, well done. Abiola, good luck. Okay, we are now less than 20 available. Sorry. That's the only one we've got. Now, we've not had that. We've not seen that for two months. And I don't think we've got any more on order at the minute. So, I can hear Lucy. Are you buying it, Lucy? Uh, <laughs> I can hear her going like that. That normally means she's treating herself. She'll have no wages left at the end of the month. She'll get paid and it'll all come back here. <laughs> right then, should we give you the halo beads as well? Shall we? I'm going to drive. I'm going to drive. Should we drive home in these tonight? Oh, yeah. And see what everybody's on the, on the motorway. They'll be like... I get the taxi to pick me up. I'll keep it on. <laughs> she's, she's, she's getting a taxi to pick her up. Uh, right then, so we have the charms. What we called the... Now, I was lucky enough to launch these, and they're so pretty. Um, so, we have got genuine gemstone charms in this halo shape. It's called the Halo Collection. And you get all three of them. So you get the labradorite in the middle, you get the moonstone and the clear quartz. R E P K. Right, okay. Stop the show again. I'm not having this. I'm not having it. Right, you put the twenty four ninety five in. Come on. Come on. Pop it on. Pop the price that we should be paying. It's fine. Put it on. It's fine. Go on. Put it on. It's fine. And then ignore it. Okay? Ignore it. Okay, ignore that. Be on my head. Could you call the call centre? Could you tell them to charge everybody $14.95? Could you put it on the strap line and then everybody knows, everybody knows that they should be uh, uh, double that. Um, RE PK 38, that takes that now down to instead of tenor a bead, a halo bead formed into that charm for you. That takes it down to £4.99 a charm. It's a great discount. I think Isn't it? The best discount I've yeah. ever seen. On here, that's great. Yeah. So we have never taken these to £14.95. Never. Never, never, never. Now they are genuine gemstones. I have seen charms made for a very well-known particular charm bracelet company um, because they are designed and cut in the same um, design house in India where we get ours from. And um, those aren't genuine gemstones, ours are. So if you are like me and you are a massive fan of genuine gemstones and you would like moonstone, quartz and labradorite in those beautiful halo charm beads, then for the first time ever on Jewelry Maker, we're going to take the last few chances. And I only started with 62. I had, yeah, I had limited numbers of these. And we will take them to a never-before-seen 14.95, which is 4.99 a charm. 
such which a, sorry no 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 please jump in darling it's just such an amazing way to display genuine gemstones isn't it really really unusual i think it's yeah. definitely worthwhile especially at that so. price yeah. yeah we've never done that we've never dared you can see the computer won't even let us do it so we're on the phone to the call center now don't worry it happens magically our call center go in change the price manually put the code repk38 and the price will be, if you are calling in on the call centre, you want to just double check that, just mention that to them. But yeah, 14 95 They are 12 by 4 mil with the 5 mil hole, which goes on the snake bracelet, the snake charm bracelet perfectly. Now then, we're nearly at single figures, I'm afraid. They're going very quickly mm -hmm. indeed. I'm not surprised. So. Yeah. So all of you with it in your baskets, if you want to join the successful Halo Bead buyers, you know what to do, don't you? Check out. Please do. Now, I do have some extra colours coming, some extra gemstones coming. Okay? Don't we, team? Now, we're going to honour that $14.95 for all of the offers. Thank you, producer. I know that's a lot of work for you, and, and to our call centre as well. Thank you very much, because that's a lot of work. Okay, so if you've gone on the phone and you just want to mention it, it's like today when I went in, today when I went into to the supermarket, there was a deal on my organic yogurt. Okay, and it was down to one pound fifty for this big tub of yogurt. I thought, brilliant! I have that for breakfast every morning with my fruit. But when I went out, I did check it. I did check my receipt because I, know, you know. Do I like, I like all sorts of Greek yoghurt, yeah? Mm. Oh yeah, I like Greek yoghurt. But I'm trying to go probiotic and organic and all that at the minute, because it's good for your gut, isn't it? For your gut. Good for your gut. It's not the nicest word, is it, your gut? <laughs> but it is good for your gut, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Probiotic. Probiotic. Live. And then when you think I'm eating live yoghurt, you're like... <laughs> 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 anyway, so... 14.95, ignore that, please just ignore the 29.95, we're not doing it. Right then, can I have an update please on how many exactly we've got left, sweetie? Right, okay. Good luck, is all I'm going to say. 14.95, now what other gemstone deals have we got? We've got black onyx. Pink, sorry, you... okay, let's just, so we've got a set of three black onyx coming up for you, again, 14 95 because imagine those slotted in, three black onyx on there. And then we've got pink, aqua, chalcedony, and white agate coming up for you. So let's get those on for you as well. We're honouring it all, 14 95 Again, they'll probably come in at 29 95 ignore it, we're not going to do it. We're just ignoring it. Okay. Should we do the black onyx next? No. <laughs> the, um, the, the, the gremlins, because gremlins is a Christmas movie, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> that was my gizmo impression. That was pretty good. Thanks. You've got the ears of gizmo, you have. Do I? Yeah. Alright. Give her gizmo ears. Don't pour water on me. I'm talking, yeah, don't pour water. I'm talking about her hat, not her real ears. I bet everyone's going to see me. Not being very nice to Nadia. <laughs> I mean the hat ears. <laughs> <laughs> I bet I'm going to have somebody go, Zina's not being very nice to Nadia this evening. <laughs> no, I mean her ears. I'm there. Anyway, now, I don't have them in the studio because that would be far too helpful, wouldn't it? But it is a beautiful black onyx. It's that polished grand piano black. Okay, so again, should be twenty nine ninety five. That's what we uh, that's what we were supposed to bring them to you at. And we said, <laughs> I don't think so. We're halving it again. If we can put the tagline at the bottom, just so we've got it in writing. Stunning polished Indian black onyx. I mean, if it was me today, I've got to be honest, and I could, because we've dropped, because we've halved the price and we've got it to 14 95 lowest price ever, 4 99 a bead, 
I, if, if I could afford it, I'd try and treat myself to all halo beads in one go. Oh, I think so too, because you could have the um, the triple colours for your day and then the black ones for your yep. night evening wear, and you'd have to get the bracelet. Yeah, yep. absolutely. The, the whole lot. And just mix and match mm. as well, because they're so yeah. easy to take. You just slide them on and off the bracelet. So they're so easy to interchange. There's no sort of messing with jump rings or wire or anything. Mm. You just open the barrel clasp, take one off, take them all off, take two off, just, just keep changing it. So an interchangeable charm bracelet, which is what, that's the whole design of them, is to mix and match, isn't it? So again, I promise you now, we will charge you $14.95. It will happen magically. We'll go in and amend your order for you in the call centre. The call centre are amazing. Thank you, team. Halo beads, which again, that lovely halo collection for, for Christmas is lovely. What's that? Is it a game? Halo? Why do I, do I look like I've heard of Halo? <laughs> I love that. You must have heard of Halo. You're like, must I? Is it a computer game? Yeah. Oh, no. So, do you know it? Yeah, I've got why two teenage boys. Oh, well, there you go. They, yeah, that's because I'm Baron Broadbent. That's why I don't know these things. I don't I know Space Invaders. <laughs> what? Why would, I, why would I play a computer game? I'd rather be outside. <laughs> no. What each of their own? So I'm so sorry I don't have them in this chick. Can we have the picture again? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Stunning. I mean, Black Onyx. Fourteen ninety-five. We still have the Aqua and the Pink Chalcedony and the Agate to come. Now, don't forget as well in the other one with those when you actually see the recording of the aqua and the pink calcedony in the white agate they're going to complement these beautifully all of these work well together actually i can tell you because i've seen it when i launched this originally um the bracelet looks really lovely the more charms you have on it i think yeah, no, I, I think, think less is more, but I actually think more is better on these. It's just because the stones are so unique, I would yeah. just pop them all on. I'd want to have to show yeah. them off all of them. I yeah. really think they're absolutely amazing. Because I don't think I've ever actually seen um, halo beads. No? Like that. Oh, have, have you not? No. Yeah, well, we haven't had them no. on very... I think we've only had them on once or twice, haven't we? But the fact that you've got this look, and just to show you, lovely movement on the snake bracelet. It's just a fantastic way to showcase natural gemstones. Isn't it, though? Yeah. Love it. I love them. So, 40... Price is there. 14... Oh. 14.95. Okay, should we do the last ones? Okay. Aqua Chalcedony. Pink Chalcedony. So you've got that lovely serene glow. Very gentle. And white agate. So the white and the black. The white agate with the... There you go. Oh. Look, there's your... Oh, they, oh, they are... They're proper loop. halo, aren't they? Oh, yeah. Aqua Chalcedony in front of you there. Coming round into view now is the pink Chalcedony. And right, right on the Lazy Susan there on the left is your white agate. Oh, they're stunning. Aren't they, They though? look ethereal. Yeah. They? they are just lovely. Code is WGPK41. And we will honour that lowest ever price point again. Twenty nine ninety five was the original. They've always then gone to 19.95 we have never so we've given you a 25 percent saving on the late show today for the first time ever on these halo beads so that was on the first ones with the labradorite the moonstone and the clear quartz that was a 25 percent saving the three of the black onyx was a 25 percent saving this is what they look like there's your clear quartz there's your halo uh, Moonstone and your Labradorite, we've given you the three black onyx, again, four ninety nine a bead. And now we go into the pink chalcedony, the aqua chalcedony, and the white agate. I think they're lovely. I'm so sorry I don't have them physically in the studio, but you can see the recording there. And again, it's the lowest ever price, fourteen ninety five for those halo beads. Well done. Okay, right then, so that is your today's must have. Congratulations. Well done. Well done. What shall we do next then? Mm. 
Now then, those halo beads, I am limited on every single one of those treats. Okay. Do we have, do we have roughly how many there were of the last set available, please? Okay, we've got less than 50 available of the, of the last set. WGPK41. Okay. Now then. We're back to some high-end splendour. Because we're assuming you've got your glad rags on. No, they've got a halo on their own, don't they? Oh, they just. Yeah. I mean, that to me is your single drop earrings on your shepherd hook of precious metal. I've got one. Let me show you. Oh, again, I'm sorry. That should have a one in front of it, yeah. shouldn't it? Oh. That's ridiculously brilliant. Look at the, what I want to show you is the color is extraordinary of those sky blue. The facet work is exemplary. And I really do mean that. You, well, you don't need me to tell you quite frankly, do you? Right then, there's now a little bit of a, there's now a little bit of a, um, a, a a bit of a, a bit of a tug of war going on over these. Ninety-eight carats of stunning sky blue topaz in those faceted drops. What I like about those as well, um, Nadia, is they're actually a, they're a good size drop for making jewellery with. They really are, aren't they? Yeah, they really are. I mean, you could do just earrings, and they would stand out on their own with just a single drop, really. But imagine you would make a whole cluster of those. Yeah, that would just be amazing. They're absolutely gorgeous. I think it would even look great in a, I don't know if you've ever seen those sort of three-pronged rings. Yes. Um, with like a clover leaf yeah. almost. With those. Yeah, that, that, that looks look, lovely that actually, look doesn't it? amazing with that. Maybe a pearl in the centre. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, make a flower with the petals, a five-petaled mm. five flower with a pearl in the centre. That would be so extravagant. I got this in silver, in sterling silver, but this is the gold plated. Now, are, are we all now thinking, oh, actually, that would be great as a charm bracelet. Christmas charm bracelet, what do you think? It's got fantastic large links to actually hang the exactly, things off it. Exactly, so sweetheart. Perfect, perfect. Now, been very popular. There's only nine chances left. What do you think? Gold. No, Anila. I've got a. I've got a suggestion for you, sweetheart. Or is that what you're already thinking? Are you thinking about putting some of those three D ambers that you bought on there? Are you? Gold plated, 925, really good oval. Now that's unusual. That's a, that's a Rolo with a twist because a Rolo is normally sort of more rounded. So to get a round, a, a, an oval shaped Rolo bracelet, it's really unusual, isn't it? They're quite large links as well. Yeah, yeah it's definitely massive. different. Love that. Now, it's a seven inch approximately, it does have a two inch extender, so that takes it to a very generous nine inch potential bracelet. There's your extender look. So you can go anywhere in between, and that actually could be shorter than seven inch because you could attach into one of these loops mm. as well and take. If you like me and you've got a six inch bracelet, a six inch wrist, if I just prove to you here, if I can do it on the top. See, look. I could actually do that up into the link itself and use the mm. extender for something else. Mm. So that would fit me perfectly on, a, on, my, on my size wrist and I could use the extender then somewhere else. No, you could cut it in half, maybe use one of those topaz to make drop earrings for that. Oh, yeah, I could. So we've got the, um, all the little uh, gold-plated ch uh, charms coming up later as well in the next half an hour. Oh. Got the little angel, we've got the reindeer, we've got the gold-plated um, canes coming up as well. And my director's favourite...
Do you know, that takes me right back as well to when my dad used to read me the story of the, the gingerbread man. Do you remember, has everybody read the story of the gingerbread man? With the naughty fox? I don't know. Is that a British story? I think so. Is I it? think it's a ladybird book. With the gingerbread man. Mm. I don't know the story. Uh, I can't remember it. I'll have to have a look. Run, yeah, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch. It was a bit of an. It, you can't catch me on the gingerbread man. He was a bit naughty and he kept telling fibs, didn't he? I think. And didn't he then ride on the back of a fox and the fox ate him? Something like that. Something like that. I love a gingerbread man. Do you? Oh, I love it. You ever had a gingerbread man? So you've had needle girdled, good and good. You've never had a gingerbread man. What's it called? Needle good and gone. <laughs> Damp Dampf noodle. Dampf noodle. Dampf noodle. Und va vanilla kupfer. What? Vanilla kupfer? Vanilla kupfer? Yeah. Vanilla? <laughs> There's a spoiler. Vanilla kupfer? <laughs> Proper Christmas treats. Uh. You can't have many of these left. Nine. Is it what I think it is? Because I bought it. I bought it as I well. Bought it. I I've bought it. I bought it as well. Right now I've got it at home. Well, actually in my bag because I picked it up today. I oh, you got it in your bag? I have it right here. I cannot wait. Isn't it? It is just... Oh, my word. That is just so cool. Isn't Sorry. It? just have to say it. It's just the right word for it. Now, I bought it as well. We have got Labradorite. Madagascan Labradorite carved amazing flower. So what made you buy it, Nadia? Just because I've never had such a beautifully carved Labradorite before. It's just so different, and I can just imagine what it would look like in a, in a nice wire weave. Exactly. Um, just to show off every single cut yep. of that stone. It's stunning. And I would think that would be actually quite easy to set. Yeah, it has got so many grooves exactly. where you can, can slot your wires in and, and just showcase. got a perfect size to showcase um, the colour of the stone and, and um, the cut of it. It's gorgeous. Can't wait. Oh, me and Anila have got a bit of connection. She went, Zena, you read my mind, dear. Mm. Now that's scary. I just had a feeling, you know. I just had a feeling. I think, see, I th Isn't it weird? Because, Anila, because you buy so, so, so often and you're here with us and you're messaging and things, I feel like I know you. Do you know what I mean? I feel like I really know what you like as a person. You know. Oh, I'll tell you what as well. Look at that. I can't get the elaborate dresses to come through properly in the studio, but it's amazing. I need to be able to show it. In fact, can I run over and show you on the overhead? I know that's... I know that... Oh, it won't show up as well on the... Because it's... When I tilt it, look. Can mm. you see the pink mm. all the way across? It's yeah, just it's not... Hard to can show you see it? Mm. it? Depends what angle you... When yeah, you set I can't it, you seem to, to get it sure. in the light yeah. properly. See there, look. See, look. There you go, look. I just need to be able to show you that into the camera. But it's only because I'm, it's, it's going up into the light, but there's too much mm. light for it, so I need to get that into natural daylight for you. But it is stunning. Yeah, was love tried. It always depends on the angle when you set it. Of course it, it so. does. That, I tell you what, that would oh, make a wicked brooch. Oh, yeah. Perfect size for that. Yeah. Yeah. 12.95. Big carrot weight, 32 carats. Joan, Abiola, Wendy, collectors coming on those. I only started with nine, my loves. Sorry. Bobby! Oh, got something else carved for you. Oh. Oh, that is lovely. Gosh, the carvings, the quality of the carvings, incredible. Oh, wow, that's beautiful. Isn't that, that stunning? That is stunning. I mean, not only is that the most beautiful fluorite, mm. but... Oh, that's just beautiful. Or flowerite. 
We've discovered a new gemstone. This is actually fluorite. We've just unfortunately got the U and the O the wrong way around. Sorry. We might as well have it on tonight, mightn't we? Everything's got the gremlins this evening. We might as well have a flower right tonight. It's not a problem. <laughs> Multicolour fluorite carved. Somebody's just messaged in both sides, Vina. Yes. Oh, wow. I love the ombre. She's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. And Nina said, I really hope I can meet you, Zena. I love watching your shows. You're so lovely. Isn't hopefully, you just... oh, hopefully oh. one day. That's nice. Come, come. Norfolk. I, we, I tell you what, I could come up. We could go on the Norfolk Broads, couldn't we? I did that once. Hired a, a boat. It was brilliant. Well, long boat. Oh, I loved it. I've cooked a Sunday lunch on one of them galley stoves in the, on the Norfolk Broads. Sunday lunch for five people. Hmm? Can I cook you a Sunday lunch? I can cook you a Sunday lunch if you want. Yeah, OK. All right. Yeah, needs to start coming back in the other direction. I bought you jellies in, I bought you ice buns in. I bought you gin. Eh? You bought me gin. Yeah, she did to be fair. <laughs> it's a really nice gin as well. <laughs> Peaky Blinders gin. It was ace. Yeah, it was brilliant. Peaky Blinders gin. It was really different gin. Most different gin I've ever had. Other gins are available. <sighs> brilliant. Well, do you, know, you now see why I needed the ice bags? I can't have a gin and tonic without a piece of ice. Because it's actually better for the gin. Is it? Yeah. There was a, I watched a whole, a, whole, a whole thing on YouTube with this bartender, this world-renowned bartender. Not that I've got a problem or anything, but... Um, <laughs> <laughs> he was saying there's two things you do to make the best, prop, the best gin and tonic. So first of all, other drinks are available. You get a nice tall glass and you fill it to the brim. Fill it up with ice. Because there's something to do with the way the gin and the tonic interact with the, with the ice. Fill it up. And then get a twisted spoon, put it in and pour the tonic down the spoon. Oh, that's amazing. And then apparently, don't ask me why, but it's something technical and I don't know. But apparently, that then gives you the best gin and tonic. Oh. And just lately as well, I've switched from normal tonic to elderflower tonic. Oh! <gasps> I've had that the other day as well. That is so it tasty. It so fresh. Oh! Anyway, it's not, it's not a cocktail show. Yeah. I just thought I'd share that with you. Um, we have not got another Savarai. Oh, no. How many left? Not many. Did the other mm. Savarai go on it sell out? Yeah. For those of you that missed the other, I'm so sorry, I didn't know I got another one on the show. For those of you that missed the Savarite Garnet earlier and it did sell out really quickly, I have nine left. Of, oh my word. Oh my word, Nadia. It is so green. So fresh wow. and juicy and. Wow. Can I just say to you as well, Anila, I would love to meet you one day as well. The feeling is mutual, lovely girl. And thank you for messaging in. No. Let go, can I take it? I can't. No, no. No way. <laughs> She's frozen. Savarite Garnet, hon, for £20. That can't be right, sweetheart. Sorry. Well. I mean, that to me is a, a bracelet all day long. Now, if you're like me and you've got a January birthday, that's your birthday, Garnet. It's your lucky day because you can have it in green. Well, that's Isn't the thing, it? because, you know, we're so used to us mm. as garnet babies expecting red or mm. purple. Yeah, that's I, it. Yeah. Mm. Um, that is incredible. I, I genuinely, I mean, I'd write the code down for myself, BTNV93, but I think it's pretty pointless. We, if you, in fact, um, there are, we are very, very limited on Savarite Garnet. Now, I went to barbecue with Steve Bennett yesterday, my lovely cousin, who started Gem Gemporia and Jewelry Maker, um, Solana's Gemporia, 
Um, and he said again, I was talking to him about, I said, what, what, we're struggling to, what are you struggling to get at the moment? Because he goes and buys gemstones all over the world. He said, Samurai Garnet. This is almost impossible. I said, well, I had heard that. He said, no, absolutely. So if you do want them, especially at 1995, mm. we, I don't mean this to sound rude because it's still got a 1995 pound price point on it, but that is genuinely a giveaway deal when it comes to this gemstone. Genuinely. I mean, that is superb. It's unbelievable. Uh, um, if you all check out, we're in minus three. Six, I know it's been a hot day. I know we've been hot and bothered. It has been too hot today, hasn't it? Do you think? It was incredibly hot. I think hot. a bit too hot today mm. for, for us. So I think it's slowing us all down a bit, isn't it? Don't you think? I went, went and cut my wisteria down again up, up on my ladder yesterday, and honestly, I was wilting. I was wilting up my ladder. Sorry? I was wilting like a little rose, <laughs> was I, Mike? <laughs> Never been called a little rose before. But there you go, that Mike, that, you, Mike's having to be nice to me because he leaves tomorrow. <laughs> so he's getting all the nice little comments in that he's never made to me. <laughs> right then, now, uh, Michelle, well done. Kath, well done. Linda, well done as well. Now, Kate, Diane, Collector, um, those of you with it in your baskets, those of you on the phone to the call centre, to get that incredible strand, do get your authenticity card, won't you? For your Savorite Garnet, your Tanzanian Savorite Garnet, your one location gemstone. 1995. You've got to be beaming from here to here. You really have. What an absolute steal. Okay, we are now way, way over allocated. That is superb. Can't believe that price. I don't think I've actually ever owned one of these before. Not many ever. people do have Savarai mm. Garnet. I think it definitely rivals um, chrome, chrome dioxide. dioxide. It really well, do does. you know what I think it is for me because of the way, because of, because of the colour of it. I think it's. Um, I think there has been a romance in the gemstone world, and I think a chrome dioxide fell in love with a peridot. Exactly, just and in the, between, isn't it? The chrome dioxide and the peridot produced a love child. Yeah. And the That's love exactly. child that it produced was Savorite garnet. Got one last look. One little last look. <whistles> Illegal police patrol. Oh, do you know what I watched before I came in today when I was having my lunch? The, the film just came on with Al Pacino, Scent of a Woman. Oh. And it, if you've watched it, just as I sat down to have my cup of tea and have me, have me sandwich, it, he was at the table with the girl, because he's blind in the film, and he gets on the floor and does that fantastic tango. And just as I switched it on, that tango. Oh, brilliant. Oh, brilliant. Oh, 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 number three, number three, number three. Oh, no, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. I've got that music as well. Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh, he does it so well. It's brilliant. Oh, Al Pacino. <gasps> Love that man. Studio lights. Oh, look. Star Ruby and the studio lights. They don't. They don't get on. You can see still. You can still see it, but you don't see the full star. But you will when you get it home. Okay, your 30 day money back guarantee. We have 120 carats of natural star ruby. You can see the star in there. It's just getting a little bit blurred because I've got so many overhead lights in the studio. But don't worry, you'll only have a single source of light, hopefully, when you get them home. So uh, we have natural star ruby. I've actually got... One, two, three, four, five, six. I've got seven natural star rubies here. So if you divide 32.95 by seven. Pardon? Less than a fiver each. Oops. 
Daisy. £4.70 each for Natural Star Ruby. Now, there's no guarantee you'll get seven. I've got seven. You might get five, you might get six. But obviously, if you get less natural star rubies, you'll get bigger ones. Oh, I had a feeling. We've got some chin, chin lovers coming in, have we? Come on, then. Zena, I like that you love a gin and tonic. You have to try the new violet gin. It's out of this world. It's so fresh and tasty. Other flavours are available. Never. I've heard there's a new hot cross bun one. Ooh. You've had that? No. You haven't? Cherry Bakewell. Ugh. That's nice. That's no. Nice. Violet though? Is that like out of the shops? Is it? I'm going to try that. Oh, I think that's the, sorry, is that sort of metallic looking swirly oh, one? Oh, is it? Oh, okay. I, I think I might be wrong. Okay. But, uh, oh, I could have slot. Jenny says he wants it. Z, you need to try elderflower liqueur. Oh, yeah. Oh, to do delicious. I'm just saying. You can just say all you like, love. Elderflower liqueur. And then um, it's only Monday. <laughs> everybody's messaging about gin. Sorry, uh, Rona and Michael said hi all. Can confirm Zena is as lovely in person, even though she usually tries to pinch my hobby. Zena. <laughs> 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 Thank you, Rona. That is very sweet of you. Thank you very much, lovely lady. <laughs> I'm getting a bit of a reputation, aren't I? <laughs> I've got a bit red. <laughs> well, I've got one of my own. I need to borrow, don't I? You know, it's not much to ask, I don't think. Denise has had two of those with their nearly gone. Well done. Congratulations. There are two chances left. <laughs> Tries to steal my husband. Um, I'm so sorry. Which one did you say? Let's go to the big... Um, let's go for the big five precious gemstones and let's give you three of them in one strand. We have the lovely blue sapphire, uh, blue, yep, blue sapphire, red ruby, green emerald, blue sapphire. I like that because you've got just blue sapphire, red ruby, green emerald. It's a perfect strand if you can't buy all of them at once. Absolutely great for that. Nice way to get used mm. to, especially that price point, £20. That's a great way to get used to um, new gemstones, isn't it? Uh, sorry, high-end gemstones, mm. you know, ruby, emerald and sapphire. Now, can I just check if I've got the right strand here? Because the recording showing yellow sapphire in there. Thirty-five carats of natural ruby, natural emerald, natural sapphire. I would order two. You might get some blue, you might get some yellow as well. Oh, hello. Oh. Now, the other day when I was on with Gemma Crow, who was on this afternoon, she had the most amazing big bar statement necklace like this. Leah's nodding at me vigorously because she remembers it, we all remember it, of Mookite. We had so many messages of Mookite, com uh, uh, Mookite coming in. So many messages <laughs> coming in about the Mookite necklace of Gemma's. How about you recreate that design but in lapis lazuli? I always love bars. Yeah. They are so modern. I love them. They're so modern. They are, aren't they? Yeah. They look so dramatic, yeah, don't they? They really do. 
statement if ever. Yeah. H D R U fifty seven. Very clear pat through, isn't it? Yeah, that you think. The shape and the colour yeah, and the agreed. history of the yep, stone of course. altogether. Can you just imagine Elizabeth Taylor? A little. I'll get my words out in a minute. Elizabeth Taylor with Richard Burton in that Cleopatra movie when she was Cleopatra, wearing something dramatic like that. Yeah, yeah she'd have. I tell you what, she Cleopatra didn't half wear a lot of eyeliner, didn't she? Seventeen ninety-five. That's a lot of lapis lazuli mm. for seventeen ninety-five, and they're not heat treated or dyed; they're natural. Oh, that's beautiful! Really, really that beautiful. That shape is fantastic for doing some simple weaves around them. Just to yeah. put a few patterns on it yeah. and decorate each single stone, so you yeah. could have quite a few um, focal beads out of that necklace. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Or you could probably get about two or three necklaces graduated out of that even, because there's so many of them there, isn't it? Yeah. Look at that. That's a lot of gemstones on one strand for 1795, mm. isn't it? Okay. So. Oh, they're different. Oh, they, I like them. Ooh, that ace. Oh, wow. Yeah. Right down my street. Look at that. Z, Z, I'd gift, my, I'd gift you my hubby, she says, because he loves spreadsheets like you, but he's a bit of a Mr. Bean. He's clumsy, but don't tell him I told you that. Well, he's, <laughs> he's like the male version of me, then. By the sound of it, if he loves his spreadsheets, I've been on spreadsheets today. I love my spreadsheets. I don't feel like my day is complete unless I've been on a spreadsheet. <laughs> I even spreadsheeted once. Well, what was in my airing cupboard? I had a spreadsheet called airing cupboard. I realised that that was a step too far, so I did delete it. <laughs> oh, but you think I'm joking? That's an absolutely genuine story. Why? Why would I do that? Actually, no. <laughs> well, I've got an in case of it. I've got I've got an in case of emergency spreadsheet, so that if ever anything ever happened to me, whoever looked at it and it would know what I'd got. So I listed what was in the air. <laughs> now, if I show you some different, just to show you how different these can be, look at this. Fascinating, a little bit like wood, I guess. Really, isn't it? In the in the sense that all woods look so different. See, look, oh, dramatically different. Oh, they love yeah. lovely. Yeah. Denise Perfect. is a bit partial to these in California as well. Such a gorgeous colour. Aren't they? Mm. Very warming. Very, very warming in every single one is unique, look. Look a little heart in the centre, look. Yeah, actually, yeah. Look, Aww. little heart. Ah, that's cute. HJNV45 for those. Are they natural, by the way? Oh my goodness me, they are natural. Fifteen chances remaining. Can I just say something out loud? About you, Director Mike. We are all as a team, as much as, for, for all the banter we give you, we're going to really miss it. Mm. I'm actually dreading you going tomorrow and it being our last show. Are we going to have drinks after the show like we used to? Should we go tonight as well? Uh, it's Monday <laughs> home, of course. <laughs> Do you want to go tonight as well or just tomorrow? Go tomorrow, okay. Right then, we're going to take him for a little cheeky. Are you going to come, Leah? I'm not here. You're not here tomorrow? Oh. He's not even here for his last show.
Be coming out Wednesday night. Okay. So I'm going to take you for a drink after the show tomorrow, Mike. Make it a date. You can come, Pasco, if you want. Lucy, you can come as well. Lucy? Yeah. You coming? Yeah. Good. <laughs> I'll get it. You coming? Yeah. Pasco? Ah, oh, there you go. You, are you here tomorrow? No. Oh. Going back. Another day, then? Yep. Another day. Are you coming? It's called the dog. And then other pubs are available. Anyway, so, the good news is... Those lovely brand new gold plated and silver plated Christmas treats are coming. Snowflakes, angels, reindeers, North Star, canes, gingerbread men. All brand new. So you get 10 of the canes, 10 of the reindeer, 10 of the angel, 10 of the gingerbread men. But I've also got amazing new treats. I'm just quickly seeing if I can get one to you before the break kicks in. Oh, hang on a second. Come here. I've messed this right up. I just want to show you. Look at these as well. I've got all these coming up in all different... Uh, look. Oh, not that. Yet. Oh, that didn't work, did it? <laughs> Sorry, I was going to show you, but we haven't got anybody on camera, so I do apologise about that. Uh, right then, so um, we're going to go to a break. Please join us after the break and all these Christmas treats could be yours. At Jewelry Maker, we are always looking at ways to provide you with a fantastic shopping experience. With this in mind, we'd like to welcome you to our new pre-order option. Selected items throughout the day will be put on display and made available for pre-order. When the presenter informs you that the pre-order service is available on an item, this is your chance to pop it into your online basket or speak to one of our brilliant call centre team members and be one of the first to secure your purchase. Our brand new Get Started with Jewellery Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewellery making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewellery designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash getstartedwithjm where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewellery making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewellery making journey. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Maker are very excited to be bringing you the launch of Umbra Jewelry Displays and Storage Boxes. Tune in on Wednesday the 25th of July at 10am where we will be joined by Umbra's brand rep Emma Russell. We have some exciting products to bring you such as the Toto Storage Box, Jewelry Stands, Ring Holders and some beautiful jewelry boxes. So make sure you're watching this Wednesday at 10am on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker online couldn't be easier. Just head over to our website, jewelrymaker.com, and click on the register link. Simply fill in the required fields and you can shop 24 7. You'll also be privy to a faster checkout and personalised offers. Jewelry Maker, your one stop shop for all your jewelry making needs. Getting started with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. When you spend £4.95 with us, you'll get a free welcome pack which contains everything you need to get started. Including step-by-step -step project cards and a DVD which will give you the chance to be able to create an arrangement of different items of jewellery. You'll also get a manual which will help to familiarise you with all the items you're going to be creating and all the tools you're going to need to do so. Plus you'll also get a free pack of tools. These will be everything you need to get started. Getting started with Jewellery Maker couldn't be easier. So why not give it a go today? You can watch our Jewellery Maker show every day on our website by clicking the Watch and Buy Online link in the top right hand corner of our homepage.
corner hit you with me bubble. But I can't because it's that side. <laughs> I can put it that side. There you go. Oh. <laughs> I, do you know, that's what I used to love making at school was pom-poms. Oh, yeah. Do you remember? Oh, yeah. Do you remember? When you'd have the... With the, the yeah. You'd have the double <laughs> ring, wouldn't you, like the donut in the cardboard. That is And then you'd wrap it all so around, cool. wouldn't you? Do you remember? Yeah. And then you'd cut around the edge and then all of a sudden your pom-pom would go... Oh, that was just awesome. And then you all the different colours would yeah. come out. Yeah. Yeah. I don't use it to make it. pom -poms. <laughs> <laughs> Um, anyway, right then, everybody's been messaging in about these. I'm so excited for you. We've got them in gold plate, silver plate. We've got all sorts of... So should we just get cracking on them? Yeah? Now, we have put this lovely festive kit together for... Oh, she's done some lovely work, as our Nadia. We've gone for the festive colours of your lovely... Um, uh, uh, nylon, so you've got your nylon cord in the green, 70 metres, and your red nylon cord, uh, both 0.4 mil, 70 metres, 70 metres, brilliant. And then, oh, oh, these are so cute. So we've got sterling, uh, sorry, silver plated, I do apologise, silver plated angel charms, 13 by 9 mil, of which you get 10. And these, which I love, reindeers, beautiful. Reindeers, 10 of those as well, 12 by 12 mil, 10 of those. And you also get these, which are brilliant. You get these lobster claw, 5 mil silver plated lobster claw, cord clasp with extender chain. That is ace. I know, they're fabulous. Yeah, for your macrame and your kumahimo. They are. In silver plate as well. Oh, brilliant. And, and a fantastic size. They're great because they're a little bit smaller than uh, some we have and they're fabulous for yeah. the thinner cord. They're great. Love them. That is excellent look. And um, thank you, Nadia. We've also got the lovely graduated white shell pearl. Now, these are these really popular. Oh, they're we've, just amazing. We've only just recently started doing these in, in different colour tones graduated like that in shell pearl they are amazing and obviously we've gone for festive white mm -hmm. to go with the green nylon cord and the red nylon cord in 0.4 mil i look great and you get so much out of them honestly yeah, i mean you, you think it's such a small strand but i got yeah like, three sets of yeah of now, Na things on them, yeah so. nadi's look at nadi's jewelry it's brilliant look at that I was thinking of my mum used to make Christmas stars for our trees. Really? So, uh, oh. Me of oh, no, look. Now, you know, and earlier we were saying, no, do you know, that actually normally when you buy Christmas earrings and things, they're sometimes a bit tacky and whatever. Mm. And I, you know, they are so lovely. Well, that's it, you know, because they are just so detailed yeah. and they've got Amazing. a nice thickness to them. They're lovely. Yeah. They really are. They're really, really lovely. Now, look at that. That, it, that's my favourite. No, no two ways about it. Absolutely brilliant. Who wouldn't love that? You can, you can imagine yourself wearing that, can't you? Yeah, no, absolutely. Yeah. For, I mean, that's one thing I would wear on a Christmas night out if I go yeah. to, with my friends for pre-drinks and all that. Definitely. Can I ask you a favour, sweet yeah. Pete? Could you just turn that bracelet around yeah, so that everybody can see that the, 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 the ending actually in position? Because it's really stylish. Yeah, it's lovely. Is it really it? worked so well with that. And as you said earlier, it can go with the Mikrama, the Kumihimo. You exactly. can put leather cords, yep. anything in there. So. so, and don't they look lovely as well? Just so elegant, don't yeah. they? Mm, Looks really, I mean, this is really stylish Christmas jewellery this could be with those lovely festive charms. I mean, oh, you are wonderful. You are. Oh, thank you. It's just the pearls. I mean, the pearls make it. You know, they honestly stand up. Stop it. But it's true. Stop it. <laughs> it's true. Stop it. It's, it's you. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I could have that and I wouldn't have made anything anywhere near as good I as that. <laughs> so. Now then, all of that, all of that, the ten reindeers, the ten angels, the three... Um, Endings there with the lobster claw, the cord clasp endings with the extender and the shell pearls graduated and the 140 metres of your cord for $24.95. That is just mm. fantastic, isn't it? Code is ZB XC56. Festive chart, brand new silver plated charms, reindeer and angel. It's gorgeous. Yeah. I love working with that. Well, I'm, I'm going to see if I can get this kit because when I go and stay with my cousin in, um, in, in Switzerland, 
Um, they've got sort of like sequined, almost as if like a Swarovski hot fixed um, false reindeer heads in silver all, oh, all around the house. And they look, that sounds awful, but they, they're like basically glittering fake reindeer heads. You know, just stylized. You know, obviously no, nothing was harmed. No reindeers were harmed. It was just, it's just false, you know. What, what oh, you call decoration, great. decorative. Yeah, but they that look great. So I'm just yeah. thinking, actually, if I did turn these into earrings for her, they'd look great in the in the house in Switzerland. They're just lovely, aren't they? Yeah, Beautiful yeah, reindeers. Yeah. Or if somebody's into Disney and likes Bambi. Yeah, oh, that's right. Yeah. Mm. Really put me into festive cheer to work with that because did you know, it? yeah, you look at these things and think, oh, since Christmas, yeah. and you remember what you know what you do around Christmas time and. You eat your Nedla gurgling. So, hey, pardon? You eat your Nedla gurgling. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Dampfnudeln. Um, Dampfnudeln. 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 Oh, am I saying that right yet? Dampfnudeln. Dampfnudeln. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, that's how like you're saying it. Dump noodling. Uh, oh, that right? Dump noodling. Dump noodling. <laughs> oh, my gosh, just know that's how she sounds. Dump noodling. <laughs> oh, you're funny. <laughs> anyway, brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Well done. What are you going to teach us? Because I'm desperate to no, see something. I'll make. show you how to make this bracelet here. So, you're going to have to make it for me when you go away on your holiday. So, okay. You okay. You're going to have to make it. Well, look, I can, McCrone, I can't. I can't do... I haven't, I haven't gone to the amount of strands you do yet. No, I've you can, you can. It's very easy. I promise you it's very easy. Okay. This one, very. And you can do it. Look, I've made... I've seen you do the big Ted. I know how complex you're... You know, she's... Yeah. Um, mate. She's got, like, she's got, don't worry, it's only 97,000 cords. <laughs> Are they? But you never, you never work with two at a time. It's fun. No, you do break it down beautifully, to be fair, so... Aww. Okay, shall I start? Yeah. Okay, okay. So, for the bracelet, we're going to have two sets of core cords, okay? So, we're core going cords. to core cords. Core, core cords. Not dampfnudeln. Dampfnudeln? Yeah. Core cords. Just want you to say it. Dampfnudeln. <laughs> <laughs> and what I've done here is I've got three on my left uh, and three on my right, okay? Um, the more cords you have, you can add in more if you want. The more cords you have, the thicker the sections will be that come out the side. I'm just going to pick up the bracelet yes, and show you what I mean. So you're going to open with this beautiful findings. It's lovely. Yeah, they're great. So I'm oh, and I'm gone. I'm gone. Look at that movement. Look! That's so lovely. Oh, it's all right. I just had to feel it. It's Thanks. so easy. It's easy to make. I promise it's easy to make. So. Um, as you have a look here, uh, we have green and red, okay? So the more cords you have, the thicker these green and red sections will you. be, yep. okay? okay? So you, need, you don't need too long of a length here because it's only as long as the bracelet, really, okay? So probably about 70 centimetres of three red, three greens will work. Attach these cords to your Mikrama board or whatever you're using, all okay. right? And I'm just going to take one of my Mikrami... Uh, I mean the long cords, and I'm using that to elevate okay. the core cords that we're having. Okay, it just gives you space to work underneath. Okay. okay. So now we need to attach our working cords. So now these need to be a tiny bit longer. I'd probably say about a meter to meter and a half, depending okay. on how long you want them to be. And I'm going to attach these to my Macrama board as well. So use um, about three quarters of the lengths pointing towards you, and the shorter section of these will go to the back like that. Okay, so you've attached these here, and you have now one red, one green. Okay. So what we're going to do now is tie a spiral knot, which is this section here. And if you use two different colors, you will get the um, sort of different interchangeable colors. Um, you could do it in solid color, but then you wouldn't get this effect down here. Okay, so to tie a spiral knot, you take any color, doesn't really matter, and you fold it over your core cords like yep. a fork. Okay, and then you take the cord on the right, and this cord will come from underneath through the section here, and you pull it tight. And this is all it is. So you just keep doing this. So it's a four. All on the same side? All on the same side. Okay. So now if you wanted to make a square knot, you would alternate a four, yes. left, right, left, right. But because we wanted to spiral, you just... Um, Keep going the same direction. Now you will notice that your cord will naturally want to twist. twist so over. don't force it in any way. You just eventually 
will let it go and then you feed the cords around because when I first Switch learned sides. spiral, I panicked that I, it was going wrong. Yeah, that's it. And I mean, um, I did the same thing. That was my first. This, yeah, that was my first ever thing. I think, oh no. Yeah, you do. You happening. panic. Mm, you do. Don't panic because it's naturally doing that because it's actually spiraling obviously around. Yeah, of so, you wanted to do that and don't don't pull it or anything. Just let the cords naturally run its course. Um, and once every five or so knots. Um, switch the cords over, so feed the green under, the red yeah, over, kind of depending. Re yeah, it's easier then, isn't it? Yeah, so just depending, don't, don't pull it uh, and then just keep going. So again, this section can be as long as you want it. I quite like to have this free under yeah. my uh, wrist. Because it's more comfortable, isn't it, if you have a good inch or so on each That's side, it. isn't it? Yeah. yeah, because you don't want any charms or anything um, lumpy, I suppose sitting there all right so once they're we go it's not lumpy <laughs> they are actually pretty <laughs> lumpy <laughs> <laughs> right so we section these out and i have the green with it doesn't actually matter which okay. color you have with which but i just for the fun of it went green on red and red on green okay. so it doesn't really matter so what we're going to do next now so attach the left hand cords away the section and we're going to grab the three red ones and that green one that's coming out of our spiral knot. And what we're going to do now is tie Lark's head knot, okay? So that's really easy. So you take your green cord and you go over your core, over, okay? Mm -hmm. Fold the cord through the loop and loop it round, okay? okay? Bring it under and this time you go under the core. So the first loop goes over and the second goes under. under okay okay Oops. and then through the loop so I'm going to show that to you and then pull it tight and this is called a lark's head knot okay so that's one then we're going to do the same thing again so remember first section is over yep feed it through come on and then under and then again instead of going over you go under and this will give you a lax head knot. Okay? okay, so if you remember that over, under, over, under, you will get the section because uh, it can be a little bit confusing in the beginning when you first start with macrame. Okay. It's just a matter of, of remembering the sequence and then you're okay. Okay. So we're making three with a green. So once we've done that, I'm gonna set this aside, tuck these into our board, pick up the cords on the left. We're gonna do exactly the same Okay. With the red, okay. So again, same thing. It's a mirror image. So mm -hmm. basically it is repeat what you just it's done. But repeat. In so the it's opposite. over. Pull it tight and bring it down under. Okay. So that's one complete. So again it is four over. Pull it tight and a four under. So I just try and, and say four over, four under, if that makes any sense. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And we're just going to keep knotting. And again, these sections are entirely up to you. You can make these longer, shorter. You can make more lax head knots, yep. less. Um, it will just change the amount of, of charms you can attach. Okay. So have a look here. This is the first section now of the two created. Yeah, okay. I will say, yeah. So now what we're going to do is we set aside the green and the red that we've used to knot. Mm -hmm. Pull these aside and we are now going to pick up the three cords, three green, three reds. Tuck these back into our board. Yep. Again, remember to use something to elevate it because it will be much easier to manipulate the cords underneath. Okay, so now what we're going to tie is square knots. So it's different from the um, spiral knot only in the fact that you tie left right so it's a four again with the left hand cord come underneath with your right pull out through the loop like so pull it tight and instead of repeating this now what we need to do is come from the other side so make a reverse four take your cord from the left and come out and pull the cord out towards the right and that is a square knot completed okay so now we're going to repeat this, but what we're going to do now is create only one half. Okay, and we are now going to pick up a charm. Yep. 
And we'll this feed it. This is the fun it. bit. It's the fun bit, yeah. That's, so we have only created the first half. So in, in this middle section here, you're going to have three knots in yep. total. Okay. So we've created the first knot plus a half a knot. Mm -hmm. Okay. Once we have created a half, we're going to add a little, a little charm of your choosing from this fantastic selection we have. <laughs> and we are going to... have got more to, to come. You've got uh, any no, gold as well. No. Gold plated. And we're going to complete the square knot. Now, the trick with this is because you want to dang it to dangle. Yeah. So uh, we've completed the second knot. Now we're going to create the first half of the last and third knot. Pull that tight, but only a little bit, and then very gently wiggle it, wiggle it so that it becomes a little bit loose. It's yeah. not quite so much, but you'll, you'll get a feel for yeah. it when, you, when you're making it. Um, you're just going to have to readjust like me now, obviously, because I'm demonstrating it to you. It's not sitting well. So pull it tight and um, then complete the knot. You'll always know uh, where you are in the knot. If you see where the little loop on the side is, so I know I have to come back because I always start with a loop on the left. Uh, and you know you're done when you are back at your starting position and you have yeah. three loops. Does that make sense? Yeah. And that's it. And then you would just keep going. You repeat yourself. So you, you now would carry on with three lark's head knots on the left, three on the on the right, uh, center section, and you keep going until you get to the end. Okay. Um, and you finish off your bracelet again with a spiral knot, like we have done here, and okay. then add your fantastic Kumihima endings with a bit of glue. We've got E6000 on the website. Okay. Um, and that's it. That's how easy it's it is. It's just lovely. Yeah. So simple. Really, can I just have a little? Yeah. Would you like this bracelet? I'll give it to you. You can have it. For you. Oh, for you. Can take I it home. Really? Yeah, you take that. For you. Take it home. Oh, oh it's very lovely. Oh, okay. oh. Christmas bracelet. Oh. <laughs> oh, I will honestly. Oh, you have no idea how much wear I will get out of that. Oh. You have no idea. I'm bracelet mad, especially Christmas stuff. Oh, are you? Okay. Oh, you're welcome. Oh. <laughs> Do we need to photograph it or can I have we done it? Thank you. Oh you are lovely. Oh. And she bought us all chocolate today as well. She did. So did you. You brought some lovely um what do you call it? Iced Fingers. finger bun. I know there was We had so nice finger bun, didn't I've never had one before. It was nice. Yeah, so good. We had the lemon curdy one, didn't we? Mm. There's raspberry raspberry ones left, boys. Mm. Oh. Well, to be fair, there are in here, but you've just not <laughs> graced us with your presence, Mike. <laughs> there's to, ce there to celebrate, uh, commiserate, Mike leaving. And he hasn't got one. <laughs> uh. Right, which ones can we... Thank you for that lovely demo. Oh, Thank oh you. it's great. Which one should we do? Yeah! So I'm all in the Christmas mood now, isn't it? There's all yeah. these gorgeous Christmas things. Can I just pop this on your board just to yeah. show how many everybody's getting? Do you yeah. mind, little pop it? I'll just take these off. My little naughty elf. Now then. This is one. This is, go back there, I think. Thank you, darling. Brand new on the show today. A premiere on the lecture. You are getting 10 of the gingerbread men, 10 of the sugar canes, the candy canes, 10 of the angels, and 10 of the reindeer. Now they are simply charming as the, as the bundle is. Thank you, sweet pea, I just wanted to show those. Now obviously you could actually go a little bit of cheeky two-tone and mix it up with the silver that we had, couldn't you? Now I've got here a love, and he's a lovely chunky gingerbread man, mm. isn't he? As I said earlier, they're very substantial. Yeah, so. love those. I mean, anybody that loves Shrek as well. Do you know? I was going to say Aren't earlier. They? That's how yeah. I heard about the gingerbread yeah. man. Not because I know the story, just because I Shrek. watched Shrek. <laughs> Other films are available, <laughs> but I think if you love Shrek, like most of us do. Oh no, yeah. it's funny. Yeah. It's brilliant. Then you, I think you're going to love this. You got the ten of the gingerbread men. 
And then the sugar canes, which are lovely, beautiful sugar canes. A lot of us hang the sugar canes on the tree, don't they? Don't mm. we? It's a very British thing, I think. I uh, know, American British. American, yeah, yeah I would have uh -huh. said. First time I ever saw it was when I went to yeah. stay in America. Yeah, that's yeah, true. With an American family. We don't do it in Germany that much. That's because you're too busy eating Nudeberg, Lily. <laughs> I'm never going to live that one down. <laughs> But oh, I love, do you I love like eating it? <laughs> <laughs> so there's the um, there's the angels, and then I think probably my favourite, just because it makes me think of Bambi. Oh. Drip drip drop little April shower. Do, 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 do. That's out of Bambi. In case you're all wondering why I've just started singing that. Uh, so gold colour um, angels, gingerbread. Men, reindeers, and candy canes. All 40 for 24.95. What's that divided? Wow, 62p? <laughs> I would definitely be getting this, and I tell you now, I'm going to be making wine glass. Now, if anybody wanted to make a wine glass charm, oh, actually, we do those split rings, don't we? They'd be good for a wine oh, glass charm. Yeah, have seed beads on them. Yeah. Oh, yes. Do you know what? I'm going to make some for when I go back home. Oh, yeah. For, yeah. That's so, gift. if you wanted That's to, great, you, so you, you get some of the split rings that we've got, would you? Yep. 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 Feed just, seed yep. beads on. Yeah, that's it. And then just make a little hook on the end and hook these on. That's yep. that's it. Really easy. I think the, the split rings we're having um, are these the um, what is that the, um, memory wire? Yeah, memory wire. Can Perfect. you have a look? We do do some split. Mm. They look like jump rings, but they're double. They're called split rings. Just want to see if we've got any. Because if we have got any, do you know how to load from code? Can we do that, Wayne? No, obviously, Wayne is new to the business, our lovely Pasco, so I might be asking him to go a step too far here. He might need to learn that. And I'm putting him right on the spot. Aren't I, my friend? Poor, poor Pasco. Bless him. We'll have a look. But anyway, yeah, we do have them. Gold colour. Oh, that's a, we're not just a split jump ring, but Ooh. a split screen. That is fancy. It's the first that time I've seen that. That is a bit fancy, isn't it? Yeah. He, put, he finally does something, in, you know, clever, that, just as he leaves. Thanks, that Mike. That's pretty cool. That is good. So, reindeers, gingerbread men. That is a fantastic kit. Christina, well done. Collector Sue, Karen, Collector Kathleen, and the list goes on. Well done. Simply charming, gold colour. And my accident... Now, the silver ones are silver plated, aren't they? Need to just check this because I think I said gold plated and they're not, they're gold coloured. Just want to make sure I'm not misinforming you. No, I'm just checking on the silver. So I just want to make sure I haven't misinformed and said plated when it's the colour. Yeah, if we can have a look, please. I just want to make sure I haven't misinformed there with the kit. It's the kit that we're looking at. Yeah. I believe they are silver-plated. So I think this, the, the kit with the reindeer and the angels, code ZBXC56, are silver-plated, I believe. Anyway. We found it. Yes, yeah, for silver plated, so that's fine. So they're silver plated, these are gold coloured. Okay, so just to confirm, silver plated in the kit and these are gold coloured. So angels, ten of them, gingerbread men, candy canes and charms. Right, we've got lots more to get through, haven't we? We've got lots more to get through, haven't we? Yeah. So cute. They're very cute. They're hurling themselves off those reindeer. Mm. Indi individually or together? Together. So, oh God, do you know, they're properly, so have you felt those? They're really Ooh. substantial, they are. So these are silver plated. 
I love them. I, you know, the candy canes are lovely, but the gingerbread men are something else. Because if I turn it around, look, they're proper chunky. Mm. It's a proper baked gingerbread men, man. These little buttons, these little jelly top buttons. He's happy as well. Happy gingerbread man. So, ten of the gingerbread men and ten of the candy canes in silver plate. Very substantial, aren't they, um, mm. Nadia? No, yeah, I like them as charms. They're great. I mean, also what I like to use these sort of things are for um, necklace endings. You know, often you have a, the oh, ending at the back, like a, a little idea. Christmassy touch. Um, they're a great size for that as well. So That is a brilliant mm. idea, hon. So you mean like when we have the extender chain mm. and then like Popped on those bracelets on. and then you just have a little drop at the end? Mm. Popped in a little sort of little accent. Good idea, isn't it? Yeah. It could be your, I mean often people use that as a sort of trademark, um, yeah. you know, with a, maybe their little stamp for you. It yeah. be a, a gingerbread man exactly, for Christmas. Yeah. Now am I right in thinking that's about 60p each? 59p each. So actually, if you think about it, we do a lot of silver plated findings, don't we? That new brilliant silver plated findings kit we do with the heart toggle. Mm. Um, so ideally, you'd put silver plated charms on silver plated findings, wouldn't you? Mm. Yeah, so that's going to be ideal for those. So Absolutely. any of our silver plated findings kits you've got, you could just add those onto some lovely chain or some lovely chef tucks, couldn't you? Well, I've just, you can make all sorts of things. I made some really simple earrings with them as well, where you combine them all in one, you know. Yeah. Oh, that is lovely. Oh, you got them all on there, like yeah. a little charm earring. That's it, got them all on there. You could add uh, birthstones to that. Yeah. Um, or what is the stone for December? It's um, Tanzanite. Tanzanite. Zircon, zircon turquoise yeah so could you pass me the angel ones i'm just yeah. going to hold the gingerbread man in front so we can show them as a pair of ears thank you yeah. sweet pea so just in case just i mean i'm having to hide the angel but just to show you what mm. it would look like on earrings the gingerbread man it has wings or it has turned into a gingerbread man angel He looks like he's got a butterfly on his back now, yeah. doesn't he? Gonna take off. Oh, I think they're yeah. fab. They're lovely. Thank you so much. Have you, when you've attached those on, what have you done? Just with a just very simple, uh, nothing but just, just straight on the earring. Charm, straight on oh. the earring. Yeah. Just so simple. I mean, yeah. to have a few of those if you have a stall or you know just yeah. on I your website. Um, sell these for maybe like a you know two, three, four, five pounds. Yeah. Depends on what you want to I'll sell them for. I think these are great things as well for, to get for the kids through the summer yeah. holidays as well, and get the kids making um, gifts for their presents and for their family because mm. these are pocket money treats, aren't they? Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So you could say to the kids one day, instead because they also you know you can't afford to take them to the cinema and to the park, to the ballpark, and to the this and to the that, and your tennis lessons and your drama. Obviously expensive, isn't it? You know, pretty much all the kids now. I think my next door neighbour's kids break up tomorrow. And Only that, tomorrow. Well, it's well. For ages. It's because they've claimed the snow days back for school. Oh no! Mm. Really? So of course I went round in on Saturday to pick up a parcel. I said to the two kids, Alfie and Lottie, next door. I said, "Are oh, we broken up?" They went, "No, oh. we've got to go in Monday and Tuesday as well." Oh. I went, stomped off. I went, "Oh, okay." <laughs> Oh, my kids are halfway. Through, well, my young is halfway through. Yeah, but Scotland, you, you go mm, much different. earlier than us down here. Yeah. You're at least two weeks before we are. Mm, yeah, no, it's halfway through. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, you can say to the kids, right, you lot, you've got to make some earrings for your nana, you've got to make mm. some earrings for your sister, you know, and you could make, and for your friends, because it gets costly, doesn't it, to, you know, get the kids making their own Christmas gifts during the summer holidays. Mm. Another job done. Ticked off. Yeah. Earn your pocket money. Exactly, yeah. Especially when they're only, like, 59p each. Yep. Okay, do you want the next ones? Can we do the snowflake connectors? Yeah. I told you we've got some lovely, lovely... These are all brand new as well. Never had them before. Now, the big ones or the little ones? Okay. Oh, they're oh, lovely. Oh, I love those. Oh. You could th do those with the gingerbread man or the angel underneath. Mm. Oh, I love those. Mm. Okay, it's not those. Oh. 
12 millimetres. Yeah, it's not those. Okay. They're coming up, don't worry. Don't, I'll just, I'll just, don't worry. That's the North Star. <gasps> We're looking for snowflakes. Oh, is that even better? They are, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh. Silver plated. Snowflakes. I literally love them. Do you know what that Go little on. star you had? Where is it? Yeah, bring it, bring I know it. what you mean. You're going to say this, aren't you? You were going to say that, weren't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, earlier we on, we had this in, um, in cubic zirconia. That's amazing. You can actually have that cubic zirconia sparkle as your pendant and have those as the earrings if you wanted well, to. I was thinking you could make it like a chain out of the snowflakes. Ooh, and then have that as a pendant. Yeah. <sighs> Centre. Oh, that'd be great. And then, yeah, I have earrings to go with that, so I have, like, a sweet. Yeah. They are just fantastic. So, 6 95 for 10. So, 70p. Well, 69 and a half pence each, but 70p, because we don't have half peas anymore, do we? No. And that's a connector look, because there is a loop on each side. Thing is, it, I'm told... That for those of you that are making for your jewellery craft fairs in sort of October, November, you've got to be making now. Mm. Is that right? Mm, yeah, yeah, no. I mean, if you want to stock up properly, you need to get going on your, mm. on your making. Yeah, absolutely. It saves it time, I mean, rather than having a last minute rush in December yeah. or November. Exactly, yeah. Mm. But again, you know, a lot of people making, um, I mean, these would just look lovely as Christmas decorations, wouldn't they? Hung in the window. Yep. I yeah. could use those to hang crystals off uh, make, oh, make a mobile make like or so. Like a Christmas mobile. Yeah. Oh, we get those in Edinburgh. We have a Christmas market. Every year they come, they have these absolutely most amazing mobiles mm, yeah. where they spin and they have these sort oh, of things. Oh, yeah, that would just look lovely, wouldn't it? But I just, I think they're fantastic. Absolutely fantastic for that price point as well. Ten of them for 70, well, you know, just shy of 70p each. 6 95 for ten of them. Okay, would you like, now we do also have, we've got them in the pendant as well. So if I just, let me show you these, look. Yeah, so those, you could have the matching pendant as well. So just to show you, look, with the connector, they go, they go perfectly, don't they? So, same design as the connector, but this time in the pendant. Well, good news is we've got them in gold as well. So, these are silver plated, 8 95 for 10. 11.6 grams of, of brass underneath, then silver plated over the top. They're lovely for, for earrings as well, actually. Not just pendants. I know we call them pendants, but... Mm. I think they're a great size for earrings, actually. You could kind of hook them up with the little ones and make a drop earring. Yeah. Mm. Can I just pop those to the ear so you can have a little look? Oh. That's again the thing I would pop into a secret center gift yeah. with a shepherd's hook on there mm -hmm. again. Mm -hmm. So Mike, my director, has just been chatting about an idea. Say it again, darling. Get a norm. Yeah, so Mike's oh. saying, have a necklace, silver plated necklace, and then have different lengths of chain with these hanging off, and it look, it would actually look like a snow, a snow, a snow. Like yeah, snowfall. I know what you mean. Oh, yeah. yeah, that'd be lovely. That's a great idea. Yeah, that'd be lovely. So um, that is beautiful. Eight ninety five. You get uh, six of these. Obviously, they are larger. They could be pendants. I'll show you as a pendant, actually. Shall I give you an idea? Oh, that looks lovely, doesn't it? Oh, I like them. Oh, they actually don't. They look lovely when they're on the skin. Look how lustreful they are. Super shiny. Oh, they're proving very popular. Mm. I thought they might. We had a sneaky feeling they might, didn't we? Nod. Yeah. Yep. Yes, we did. Just a really obvious snowflake as well, design, isn't mm. it? 
I yeah. was quite partial of these sort of star-shaped Christmassy yeah. snowflake designs just because they evoke so many sentiments. Yeah. But, uh, they are lovely, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, but we do, the good news Aww. is, have them in the gold as well, because I think these look lovely in two-tone designs. Mm. Yeah? It'd be quite nice if you just put a jump ring through both and have them as a necklace, so kind of like yeah. a double pendant. Yeah, that'd, be lovely. that'd look lovely, wouldn't it? So, OK, we've got um, 8 95 for those. A lot of people coming in on those. Would you, what, should, what should we do next, producer? Right, should we do the connectors and then the pendants again in the gold? Just to keep it easy. They yeah, do have that North Star coming up as well. Oh, just oh do you remember that? The second star to the right shines. Da 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 for something. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> it's so, from Peter Pan. Uh -huh. The second star to the right shines something, something for you. Or oh, something like that. Can't think how it goes. I'm gonna have to go and watch Peter Pan now. Dear mate. My dad's Peter Pan, you know, he's 74 and he's, he just doesn't age. <sighs> he's either an alien or he's Peter Pan. I've not established which yet, my dad. <laughs> he just never ages. Benjamin. He's like Benjamin Button. No, he's not going backwards, he just doesn't age. Very odd. Six, no, I think he might be pickled in whiskey, that's the problem. <laughs> Six, <laughs> 95, my dad. He's brilliant at 74, honestly. He shows no signs of slowing down, he's ace. Well, if we carry on, we might achieve that with jigs. Yeah, well, yeah, we jig. Should we try? <laughs> yeah. Pick ourselves. Yeah, so, um, yeah, same design as the silver. You could, you could, as we said, you could combine the two and go two-tone. That would just look lovely. That's a great idea, actually, for Christmas presents for people that you may mm. not know which is their preference, the yellow mm. gold or the silver colour. Yeah. And then pop them both in, and you're kind yeah. of edging your bits, really. You're only missing rose gold then, really, aren't you? Yeah, that's yeah. why I oh, That's lovely. Yeah. Do you know, it'd look great if you just use a bit of, we've got our Stardust uh, silver beads, and if you would just pop like a string through the loop and yeah. use a Stardust bead to close up the loop yep. and make a simple bracelet. It's just a very, very simple um, mm. sort of macrame design. Yeah, be great. It's but, really yeah. pretty. Really, really pretty those are, aren't they? Uh, but again, Nadi's just proven how simple it is, just adding them into the, into the shepherd hooks. Simple. Yeah. Mm. Literally as simple as that. And they look fantastic. Okay, so we'll do the pendant to match, my lovelies. And then we got the Northern Star. Do, 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 do. So again, we have, we've talked to guest designers in the past, guest designers that sell their jewellery. And it's always said, anything nature inspired, so. Or, or, That's or, true. Yeah, yeah. so your, your hearts, your flowers, your... I say nature inspired, but you know what I mean, living, so to speak. Mm. I think also anything that's Moon got to do with stars. festivities yeah, and I think so. special Seasonality, holidays. That's yeah, it, I yeah. agree. Mm. Yeah. Because I think we think of Christmas and hopefully the majority of us smile and feel nostalgic. And well, that's it. I mean, there's a reason why it's so big around Christmas time well, sales. Yeah, it's you know? so important yeah. to people, mm. isn't it, Christmas time? Nice family time and yeah. friendship and chance to sort of look after one another a little bit more. Mm. I think we could all do with a bit of that, couldn't we? So gold colour, base metal snowflake pendants, my lovelies. Pendants, well, I, we shouldn't really call it a pendant because it could be anything you like. That could be a charm, mm. it could be earrings, it could be a choker style drop, it could be pendants as well, whatever you fancy. Do you know what they would look great? If you have a cabochon, a cabochon. Uh, a cabochon. Right. Cabochon. Right. Like these, the wood cabochons that we had earlier. Mm -hmm. And if you would just frame it and then have one of those um, hanging on, on top of it, yeah, that would nice, look it? absolutely stunning yeah. because it would really bring out the stone as yeah. well as the, the snowflake. So yeah. that'd be interesting. Mm -hmm. So, lovely pendants. Okay. I do like these actually. Um, the connectors, what a lovely size they mm. are. I, I, I've, I've got, can you write the code down on these please? I, I think these North are just, yeah. Aren't they? They're, they're, they're just fab. Some people put a, an angel on the top of their Christmas tree, a lot of people mm -hmm. go for the star. I've got a star on my tree. 
Yeah, me silver. too. I do have a star as well. I've got actually a fiber optic one. Oh, what? yeah. <laughs> and I'm all fancy. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Told you. Do you know, I'm a bit naughty actually. Well, there's reasons, but the last two Christmases I haven't put my tree up. Have you not? Oh. I'm determined this year to put my tree oh, up. Yeah. Okay. I sometimes I just don't want to. I mean, I think, you know, once my kids leave the house, maybe I won't put trees up. No, we've know. got to put it up. I'm determined. We've got to put oh, mine yeah. up this year. Put my star on the top. No, it's true. Because it really, honestly, when you put the tree up, actually, it right, lovely, it feels lovely, doesn't it? It really amazing. does. And yeah. I've really missed it the last couple of years. Yeah, the yeah. lights and all that. Yeah, yeah, it's really magical, isn't it? So I'm determined to get mine up this year. So silver plated. North Star connectors. I do have the pendants to match as well. So we, I do think we've given you lots of options as well for the um, wine glass charms, haven't we? Mm, oh, yeah. And champagne. 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 No, that's Italian. Is the way you're saying it. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Good. <laughs> Dampfnudeln. Dampfnudeln. That's it. Oh, you can do Good. Good. What are we having at yours for, 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 is it, is it pudding? Or is it dinner? Eh? Is it a dinner or a pudding? It's, it can be both actually, oh. yeah. What are we having for dinner? Dump for noodling. You can also have <laughs> schnecken noodling. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> You're making this up. I'm not making what it. What is it? Schnecken noodling. Schnecken noodling. <laughs> That's my new favourite. Let's go to Nadia's. Can we have schnecken noodling? <laughs> schnecken noodling. <laughs> <laughs> German is, is quite a funny language. You don't know, I sound rubbish like, you know, what's it? Turkey? No, I'd rather have Schneckenuden. Schneckenuden. You sound like Scooby Doo. Schneckenuden. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, no, dear, we do love you. Schneckenuden. <laughs> That would be my new Schneck nickname. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who have we got on the show tonight? Schneckenudden. <laughs> oh, I have that done. <laughs> That's it now. Schneckenudden. <laughs> You'll have forgotten how to pronounce it. Thank you. Oh, yeah. I've been messaging What was it again? Schneckenudden. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I've got to stop now because I've got, my tummy's hurting from giggling. I'm wearing it. I'm putting it up. Oh. That when that catches the light. Mm, love it. Not fab. So if you're at your if you're at your New York at your, you know your New Year's Eve disco. Oh, that! How much do they? How much do they each? Wow. Is that right? One pound. Is that right? One pound forty nine. That's brilliant. One pound forty nine. They are. Oh, I really like that mm. one. I, I like all of the lots we had today, but the stars are especially great. Stars and the snowflakes. Because so star doesn't have to just be Christmassy, does it? It's not like the stars just come out at Christmas, is it? Yeah. Do you know, can, I wonder, you can probably stamp on those, you know, as Do you well. not like them, then? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Snuggin' <in. laughs> Can I go now? <laughs> No. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, you could stamp on <laughs> with the stamping, you know. Yeah, but not nice just to <laughs> schnecken noodle. <laughs> I don't think you fit schnecken noodle on it. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, anyway, uh, yeah. I tell you what, Christine in the Channel Islands is loving these new treats, aren't you, Christine? And I saw quite a few. She's having. Yeah, but I would say Christina in particular has taken a little bit of a. Um, a little bit of a fondness to these. Mm. So, do you fancy them in gold? Oh, yeah, let's see them together. Be amazing. Do you think when you look at up in, in the sky and it's a clear night, do you think the stars look silver or gold? I think it depends what you're looking at, really. Which kind of stars. Sometimes you... I think in Africa anyway, especially if you lie and you look at the stars, the stars have different colours. Sometimes they're gold, sometimes they are silver. Well, you say that. When I went on safari to South Africa and we turned all the, um, the, the, the guides, took us out into the, 
Not the bush, you call it. The bush. What do you yeah, call it? The bush. Bush. Took mm. us out into the bush. Switched the light, the the big jeep because they're the open back jeep things, aren't they? Switched it off. Pitch black. We saw the mm. proper Milky Way. It's amazing. <gasps> I know. It's amazing. I mean, we spent hours, nights, you know, just having our gin on the side, oh, yeah. lying on our backs, looking at it's, the stars. I've never seen. It's mm. my, one of the most wonderful experiences of my life. Mm. Until he turned the headlights back on, and we were surrounded. By hyenas. Well, you never. Really? Oh, I was a bit like, <laughs> they're right there like that, smiling at you. And you're like, <laughs> you went, you're all right. They're quiet, quiet, eh? They're quiet, a sneak out. <sighs> yeah. Oh, amazing. Oh, that must have been a fantastic experience. It was, a, it was unbelievable. Mm. I'm going back. I can't wait. Oh, yeah, can't wait. you lucky thing. And there, can't wait. You lucky. She's going back home soon. going home. So. Gold colour of the North Star connector. So you can have 10 for 70p each, 6.95 for 10. We've got the larger one coming up as well for you in the gold colour. All brand new. Let's see if Christine likes them in gold. Don't feel pressured, Christine. I'm standing a little nose to see if you're getting them. We're nosy like that here, aren't we? No. Yes, we are. Oh. Should I do them? <laughs> Can't help myself now. So yeah, so in the gold uh, with the Northern Star, we've set, we've given you lots of. Oh, I'll show you as a, as a if you want to put it in um, in a bracelet because that look pretty. You could just do a lovely wish bracelet because wish upon a star. Mm, oh, that's you? true. Yeah. yeah, wish bracelets are a lovely thing to give to somebody, aren't they? I know because they're kind of special against yeah. that sentiment. Yeah. Mm. You're so cute. <laughs> Even that daft art, you're still cute, isn't she? Oh. I think you look particularly cute in that. Even turn it round so you can see your ears. My ears. Oh right, all right. I've got it wrong. There you go. I can see the ears now. <laughs> 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 ah! <laughs> now I look like Scooby Doo. <laughs> like the silver and I love the big ones because mm. I think the big ones you really get the effect of the North Star don't you mm. I think they're great those are amazing one is that one pound 49 again yeah one pound 40 oh, just, he's, my producer just an Elvis impression oh yeah oh. <laughs> oh. yeah I sounded like a French Elvis Presley didn't I Eight ninety five. Well done. Yeah, Christina is loving these. I can see. Oh, oh yeah, she's uh, back. Can she's she? back. She's here yeah. from the Channel Isles. She's obviously stocking up for Christmas already. She is, I think. Clever lady. I what she's making. Mm. Okay. Now then, if you love these, I'm going to re-show you the snowflake from earlier. Okay, because we did this earlier on in the show and you may have missed it. Now, how many do we have left? We'll, we'll check when we load the graphics for you. Because this is... Um, Christina, I don't know if you were watching earlier, Sweet Pea, I want to give you the chance to get this snowflake. Covered in sparkly, fiery, stunning cubic zirconia. I think I'll have to go and get one. I'm, mate, I'm going. I'm, mm. I'm going to go. I'm, do you know how many I'm going to get? Three for myself, earrings pendant, mm. two for gifts. I'm going to buy five. I think, yeah. Price no, I definitely need it for my sisters for Christmas, and I'm going to take some for my sister-in-laws when I go back home. You need a few, then. How many are you going to get? Well, I need a... I've got two sisters and several sister-in-laws so, so yeah, you're gonna need a few about then five yeah or i'm six. buying five uh -huh. oh well, actually i'll get the same there we've got enough left oh, look at that look, look at the colors, that colors coming yeah through. Oh, now because oh, of, you can actually see the fire there in the recording oh, which you'll see no when you get way. it home mm. stunning pendant that's the thing about cubic zirconias because i mean as i said earlier i often bought you know other crystals and they just don't have the no. color play that you get with no. cubic zirconias and that's the thing because they're designed to have the, the adamantine luster mm. of a diamond they're, they're designed to be eye clean there is no orange uh, brown tinge or yellow tinge that you can get in a poorer gray diamond they are white they are mm. bright they are eye clean they're brilliant they're designed to look like a flawless diamond and that's exactly what they're designed to look for to look like rather they look super i'm going to show you on the neckline it's 20 mm. by 17 mil we're thinking um certainly look at the brightness from there look mm. we're thinking a lovely suite of jewelry earrings and necklace to match isn't that fantastic in, in sun, in sunlight can you imagine yeah. the color play yeah and look at that 
Under ten pounds. Crazy. It's also the lowest ever price. It has never gone under ten pounds before. Never in the history of this beautiful snowflake. So just like the snow falls, the price has fallen as well. Eight ninety-five. Okay, we are limited on this one. I'm afraid. Mm. We don't have a big number. Do be quick, because because between us, Nadia and I are looking to get ten when we come off air. Mm. Are there still any left? Five each, you do need to be quick. Now, Karen, Kimberley, Joan, Collector, um, gosh, uh, Angela, oh, Katarina, well done, Anita's had two, Joan's had two, Anita's had two, Sonny's had three, everybody come in on those. Oh, I don't know, Not if we're going to get them. I know. I don't know. They are just adorable. Alison. <laughs> oh, yeah, Alison. <laughs> How many has she got to get you? She needs four, I need six. six. Oh, hang on. You That's did say fine. I need six, didn't you? Just checking. <laughs> I'm not sure what you said then. <laughs> she did. She said six. I'm just checking. 925 sterling silver cubic zirconia snowflake charm. 20 by 17 mil covered in sparkling cubic zirconia. It is amazing. Um, I told you some people might not have been watching earlier. I told you. Did I said we're going to have to recap that if there's any left. How many left? How many left? Oh, oh no. We're going to need to be quick, Nardi, when we get off. Hello. Olive's just had another two. Oh, good for you, Olive. That is just superb. Mm. Code QIRF46. Wonderful piece. I just want to show you the side profile as well. Look at that. I mean, it's a really oh. considerable. Yeah, no, this is stunning. Yeah. Well, that's your side profile. Mm. Isn't it beautiful? Show you the reverse as well. So you can see how well it's made. It's going to be so comfy. Mm. No, it's gorgeous. I absolutely love it. And they. It's going to make such an amazing gift, I think. Can't wait. Can't wait to actually give it to you. <laughs> and that's the lovely thing when you yeah. get something as beautiful as this. When you've made it, you can't wait. The anticipation of that person you've made it for and them opening it. When they open so the box. It's so exciting. Yeah, it is, yeah. Especially when it's such a gorgeous piece of jewellery like that. So, yeah. Mm. Lovely, isn't it? So, snowflake sparkle. Sparkling snowflake in that lovely design. Well done, everybody. Eight ninety five. Superb. Well done. Um, I do also have. I've got to be quick though. She said. He says. She says. As he gives me like loads of things to get out. Now then, these. Oh my goodness me! I had these when I was on with Fleur. And it's the final. I oh, know, let me put that one on for you. Oh. The final eight chances to get the multi, multi cabochons. Oh, look at that. I know. Feel free to pick them up because I've only got two hands. Pick them up, pick them up. Look at that one, yeah. Oh, it's got no, no, no. Oh. We have got here multi shapes, um, multi gemstones, massive 460 carats of gemstones in this selection. For $9.95, it will sell out this evening. It's the last chance. A lot of you buying two each of these so that you've got... To... How many did you say, sorry? Eight left. Oh, that's not going to be enough, hon. Mm. Oh, sorry. Do be quick, my lovelies, because it's about to sell out. Uh, now, Julie Susie wants to say that. thank you, gorgeous girls, for a thoroughly entertaining evening. Nadia, love that your sense of humour is coming out more sleep tight, Aww, Julie thank Sue. thank you. Oh, how lovely. She doesn't have much choice when we're playing her up, does she? <laughs> <laughs> thank you, though. Well oh, done. That was great, thank you. She's amazing, isn't she? And that is the loveliest thing. I, I am going to get so... Nadia gave me this earlier. Aww. And I'm going to sure. have the loveliest time with that. Thank you so much. Oh, pleasure. I absolutely. Like you'll see that when I'm on. I'll be going, ooh. <laughs> uh, right then, now, the Christmas in July, I believe, is continuing till Friday, I think. So, uh, yeah, Christmas in July. So we've got Christmas Eve, technically, tomorrow, because it's 24th. Oh, Christmas yeah. Day. Then Boxing Day, and then the day after Boxing Day. I know, we're going to have to skip that one. Yeah. We'll go straight to New Year. Yeah, straight to New Year. <laughs> so we've got lots more lovely treats coming for you. We've also got, um, I think, Alison Tarry's lovely um, Angel DVD being re-released. I'm going to see yeah. what she's made. I want to see it. Beautiful. Right, it's going to be amazing. Yeah so, we, yeah, so we've got, I think that might be on the show tomorrow. 
I believe. So anyway, that's been re-released for you, so thank you. Thank you for your lovely messages coming in this evening, and thanks for joining in the fun with the Christmas, uh, the Christmas cheer, which will continue tomorrow. Late Show crew, many thank you. You've supported me as always, and I'll see you on the Late Show tomorrow with Claire. Bye. <laughs>